you guys. Oh my god. Oh, I'm so glad you're here. Oh, hi. Hi, friends. Oh, hello. Guess what day it is. And guess what day it is. Not sharp. I'm knocking everything over. Oh god! I just want to put the sword here. Not find a cone. Hi guys. Ooh, hi. Majima's everywhere except it ends right here. <laughs> Nothing else under there. Cones are expensive. Yeah, I know. I know, man. I know. Hi, hello. Oops, I gotta flatten my hair. Hold on. Nice and silky. Do you guys like my haircut? <laughs> um, and you know what? I can see you. I can see through this, so don't worry. Not if you claim one from the side of the road. Oh, that's true. That's true. Mm. I killed one of my wigs, yeah. I gave, um... I am uh, not a hairdresser, obviously. Uh, but I did this cut right here. Does it look good? <laughs> I don't know how to cut a man's hair, um, but that's why I did a, I did a really nice cut. I, I think, well, I think I did a nice cut on this side. We'll, we'll see. Um, hello. Yeah. John Hunter. I hope so. Yeah. I think so. Hi, everyone. Hi. Hi, Bionic John Ace. Hey, Daisangwa. Hi. Hi, Mr. Tasty, um, AJ, 
Blamtagus. Hey, Bones. And Star Spider. Hi. Look how cool this jacket is. You know who made this possible? Is Ataxia bought me this jacket off my Amazon wish list a little while ago. And it was very nice. I altered it a little bit to be a bit uh, more sleek. Always uh, good to alter everything. Oh my God, I was up so early making this cosplay. I didn't even prepare this the day before. I had to, I'll show you what I did. This, uh, my beautiful corset that I purchased, the zipper broke on the back of it. So I had to uh, quickly corset it. I had to quickly make a corset <laughs> very fast. <laughs> Uh, is fat, the fastest corset I've ever corseted. Uh, and I cut the wig from scratch and I made the eye patch and I altered the jacket. Oh, I did so much stuff this morning, uh, but it's so worth it. Oh my God, this could be my favorite costume of the whole year. You guys know how much I am obsessed with uh, Majima Goro. Oh, Stephanie! Stephanie, thank you for the five! Yeah, 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 yeah. I like them too. Hell yeah, Rachel, Phoebe, Monica, Joey, Ross, Chandler. Is that all of them? Good on you for naming them, I can't. <laughs> Thanks, Stephanie, I'll put you on the mug. Can you sing 24 hour Cinderella while roller skating? Uh, yes. words to it, <laughs> especially in Japanese. <laughs> oh, yeah. 24-hour Cinderella is a banger. Uh, hey, hot dog, come on, ça va? Uh, hello. How the hell do you make the holes a hole punch? Guess what, Mr. Tasty? I used a soldering iron. I have to say, uh, you use what you got uh, on hand. Soldering iron uh, surprisingly pokes perfect holes. Uh, in a plastic blend uh, zipper. It's all, uh, and then I also use the soldering iron to uh, <laughs> uh, to melt the edges of the cord, like a shoelace. All the things a soldering iron and a girl can do. Um, hello there in YouTube. Hey Alexander, HBB, Rodney. Hello Josh, Max, Bionic. Love Life, Steven, Ricky. Hello, Red Pyramid, Adam Ilson. Hi, Rodney, Dark Swords, Barry. Mm, Stephanie, Jim Jones. Hey, Christine, Josh, Jason, Dale, Chad, Brian McGuire. Hello there, Eric, Ricky, Stanky, Patrick, Gary. Hello, Frank. And, ooh, I think I got everyone. So I'll pair it. Hey there, Nico. Hello. Thank you. Hi, Mr. Tamiya. Thank you, Alexander. 
Ace says, where is Dusty? Playing the Suica game, I bet. Yes, probably. Uh, oh my god, I was playing that last night before bed. Not a good bedtime game. The, the, the fruit game. Uh, oh my god, that really riles me up. I get really mad at the fruit game. And I'm not as good as uh, Dusty is at it. I will get there. The best score I got was like 1800 and that was like the sweatiest try hard fruit game effort that I've ever done. And it was also a huge amount of luck. There's so much luck involved in that game. Uh, no, not Fruit Ninja. Uh, Suika, S-U-I-K-A for Switch is fucking great. Hi Psytech, hi love, hi uh, gameplay. Hello there, AJ. You've been playing it too, Ace? You used- Oh my god, Mr. Tasty! While it was on? Like, to cauterize? Hmm. Hi, Graf. Hi, Matt. Hello. How's it going, guys? I think we should play some other uh, Yakuza music while we uh, get all crazy and uh ready for this game scary scary finger hi hey graph for life how's it going nice to see you scary oh mr jc that's awful but smart i might do that one day let's see what other yakuza music there is we could dance to one yeah oh this is called Friday night how does Majima dance Heater? You want me to play Heater? I find it. Is that the name of a song? I can't remember. Oh, I was like, what's the name of the song? Hell yeah, that's a banger. Oh, let's do Disco Queen. <laughs> I can't imagine my dance. Today is a diamond from Yagoda 6, okay. <laughs> Thank you. Yo! Wow, you're the best awesome cosplay outfit. You have been knocking them out of the park. GG, cheers. Love you. Hi, Ruka. Meow. Send me three more games on Steam. Can you check and accept? Yes. Thank you. Kindly, Steve. Woohoo! Yeah! Gonna put you on the, uh, the mug. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, just a turkey. How'd you lose the eye? I was getting tortured by uh, a rival faction. 
A bad man. I forget the name of the guy who did it. Can't hear shit. Oh, that's a... That's a banger. Oh, yeah, get up, my baby. Yeah, oh, yeah, I, <laughs> I like the accent he sings that with. Oh, that's cute. Okay, that's enough Yakuza sing along. Or is it? Uh, the video that accompanies Kiryu in this as iconic, it's where the thumbs up comes from. <gasps> really? Oh, I didn't know that's where the thumbs up stuff came from. Okay, that's adorable. Uh, thank you, Blamtagis. Wonder Woman is your fave because the awesome makeup until now. <gasps> Thanks. I like that one too. But, uh, Majima is, uh, my favorite character out of every single game ever. Ever. No matter what. So it's like amazing to cosplay as him and uh, also be like a like a sexy, uh, you know, like a female kind of like cute Majima. Not so masculine. A little bit though, a little masculine here. Um, Nico. Yo, Nico member for seven months, dude. Woohoo, glad to have been here for seven months and look forward to many more. Thanks again. As always, thank you for the great streams and fun times. Welcome to the Book of Souls. Oh, I put a special Majima um, alert on that you guys will like. Um, I was thinking of putting it for all of them. But I only just popped it on like the twenty dollar one, I think. Or maybe the third. I think it's twenty. Oh, let me check. Uh Nico. Time Oh no, not times one. Nico in the book of souls, man. Thank you. Oh, thanks for liking my tattoos. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, I had to order these tattoos from the States. Uh, this lady custom makes uh, tattoos from all different video games and movies and stuff. And I had to get these specially made and I, I custom sized and everything. But I couldn't afford the whole, uh, the whole body. That would have been extremely expensive. Thank you. Uh, yo, Nico with the 10. Hell yeah. Thank you very kindly, Nico. Thank you. Mm, Yakuza, the man who erased his name, is out in two weeks. Mm. Hey, Galaxy Fighter. Yo, member for nine months. Welcome to the book. Welcome to the Book of Souls Galaxy. Uh, hey, Hero Zen Zero. Hey, Monger Face. Hello. Does it say which states? Oh, that I got them from? Uh, New York, I think. I think. I can't remember. So, you are not a pirate. No, I'm not. Oh, my God. I'm Majima Goro. Look, uh, Google him so, uh, or I'll show him on the screen. So nobody gets confused. Yeah. 
<laughs> Perfect. Yeah. Got one. There he is. Oh, that's me. Yo, Steve, thank you for the five. Faruka, meow. Thank you very much, Steve. Appreciate that. This is him. And this is me. <laughs> thank you. Obviously, I'm not bare chested uh oh yo another 10 for a nice cool one cheers and salute thanks steve hell yeah thank you yo keshar Um, cool ass uh, fucking pirate, yes. Did I go with PC, uh, PC version, yes. She's your favorite character from Yakuza, uh, which? Why not, man, take the cosplay all the way? No way. Uh, you have to go. Your brother's birthday today. Oh, happy birthday, brother. Thanks for stopping by, Steve. And thank you very much for the stream support. Hi, Dustin. Hey, Lillian. Hey, Jay. Carrie. Luis. Ivana. Uh, hello. CKST. Hi. HBB. Hey, Sean. Uh, Goro, I'm saying that's my favorite from Yakuza. Oh, you said she. That's why I was like, what? Oh, you mean Goromi? What about Goromi? I like Goromi. I was considering Goromi as well. Hey, Fish Base. Welcome to the Book of Souls. It's been a fun six. Oh, hell yeah, Fishy. Welcome to the Book of Souls, fish. Oh, uh, can you look in Steam? Yeah, sure, I'll look in Steam right now. Let's see what games you sent me. Let's see, let's see. I received a gift. Ending gifts. Oh, nice, Strange Brigade. Cool. I accept... Nice. Thank you for Strange Brigade. I, I made a video about that a couple years ago, I think. The Devourer. That's a scary game. Thank you. I accept that too. Oh, Ghostbusters. Spirits Unleashed. <laughs> perfect. Oh, perfect Halloween gifts. Thanks a lot, Steve. Thank you for the Steam games. Much appreciated. Oh, she as in Megan who dressed as Goro is a she. Oh, uh, I wish I was in. Yeah, because uh, it was pinned to your YouTube channel for so long. Oh, was it? Yeah, it was a while ago. Hi, Christopher. Hi, Dragon Sky. Hi, Barry. Oh, you got all the Arkham games. Shadow of Mordor at War, Mad Max, Mortal Kombat 10 and 11 for 10 bucks. Oh, that's a really good deal. That's cheap as hell. So, I mean, obviously, as you guys know, I am going to be playing Alan Wake 2 today. And we're going to be playing very shortly. I just got to change something. Alan Wake 2.
Perfect. <laughs> oh yeah, nice. Okay. Uh okay. Uh very nice. Uh yes, uh for sure. I'll try to see. Uh so we aren't playing Yakuza. No, a brand new game came out today. A brand new game. Ooh. That is so good. I um made a hazelnut coffee and uh then i added uh oops uh sugar free uh almond milk and ice and it uh tastes freaking amazing hazelnut mm. hi david i'm glad everyone's here now there is a recap on their page. Not sure about the game menu. Uh, Alan Wake would have been an easy cosplay. Just go in Dusty's closet. No! I'm not gonna cosplay as Alan Wake. I don't even like him. Or do I? I have no idea. What's the stuff floating in the drink? Uh, the ice. Ice cubes. Um, so wait, is this, uh, game actually con conti continuous, contingent, contingent, uh, congruent, contiguous, con, ah, fuck, what's the word? Continuity. Is there continuity between the games? Uh, is there a recap? Because, uh, if there isn't, then we'll just, uh, YOLO. Yeah, there's so much ice in it, John, that it's so fast to drink. Instantly. Uh, contraband. Uh, continuity is an illusion. Good point. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Am I wearing uh, the blindfold for the whole stream? I mean, I can. I made this today. It's completely transparent. It's, uh, I can see right through it. I'm, I made it special. I'll show you. That's not really showing you anything. <laughs> Trust me, I, I made this today. I can see it. I can see through it uh, very well. Just did a little, uh, little magic on it. Hi, Gothago. Hey, uh, a pointless point. Mm -hmm. Pixie dust. Not on this stream. Uh, oh wait, Alan Wake doesn't have the character Alan Wake as the protagonist. Make that make sense. Wait, Alan Wake's not in this one? <laughs> uh oh. Well, I didn't know that. Hmm. The developers of this game are Finnish. 
What did they finish? Yeah. <laughs> Alan Wake is on paid leave. Why? What did he do? Did he shoot someone? He got put on uh, desk leave. We're gonna switch to the game in uh, one sec. I am just doing something. He has the game needs NVIDIA driver updates. Don't you worry, I got them. I got the driver updates. Oh, uh, you guys, something I would really appreciate if you would uh, do for me as a, an amazing favor is go to my Instagram. <laughs> And follow me and look at the last picture I posted last night. It's of the cosplay from last night and it's a little saucy and I would appreciate your uh, like and uh, everything on it, please. Hey, oh my God, you guys, Super Chats. Burnaby, thank you for the five. Uh, oh, good day, have a great stream. Jim V played this game last night and liked it. Oh, good, 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 I'm glad he liked it. We have similar taste in games. Uh, and Steve did 2181. Oh, hell yeah. For a nice cold one later. Cheers and salute. Glasses. Clink, clink, clink. Tiger says hello to Ruka. Meow. Thanks, man. Thank you. Thanks, Bones. Oh, is it like a tomato sauce? Hmm. Oh, uh, I would say more like an Alfredo. Oh, it was a trick. Look, I believe all of you guys, you guys always, uh, I just believe you guys because I trust you. Hi, Emma. Bring on the thermos. Oh, Max Payne Remedies from Finland. Is it the same developer? Thanks, Emma. Mm, yeah, many, uh, Remedy Games did the control game too. Well, they're freaking amazing, and they're gonna. This is gonna be amazing. Uh, yeah, Emma, I'm playing um, the Alan Wake two right away. Just a couple super chats are coming in here. I think. Oh, that's what it is, Bionic. <laughs> Uh, cringe. Cringy. Bullet time and a lot of shooting and, uh, yeah, maybe Lunar. Oh, Lunar, um, I should use the katana to chop the Lunar pumpkin, actually. Maybe. <laughs> maybe. Thank you. Uh, yo, Christopher. Hey, Christopher, thank you for the super chat. Woo! Uh, hell yeah. Great content. Keep up the great work. Dude, Christopher, thank you kindly. Thank you very much. <laughs> thank you. Nice. And Steve with the 777. Farbruka items, treats. Woohoo! Cheers and salute, guys. Thanks. Thanks a bunch. Uh, Emma, no, not just Trovo, um, Twitch and YouTube kick. Trovo. Mm-hmm. Hey, Creed. Hey, Kenny. 
Hey, Zanek, Fabio Piccolo. Hello, Joshua. Okay, guys, let's play the game. I am ready. Uh, I am so, so ready to try Ellen Wake 2. Spooky. I'm gonna play with the uh, Xbox controller. Feels right, I guess. And that means I can sit a little further back, which uh, I have uh, become accustomed to. It's actually uh, a little bit more comfortable. And I can lean back and sleep. Mm hmm. Kenny, I'm great. How are you? Zanuck, hello from Ghana. Whoa, hey. Hello from Canada. There's nudity. You can turn it off if you want. Hmm. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, uh, yo, another super chat. Holy shit, man. Whoa, dude. Hey, Steve, thanks so much, man. Thank you for supporting the stream so much. Steve, thank you for the 50. And for sure, the Ruka toys or other items. Woo! Thanks, Steve. Woo thank you for supporting my stream. Oh, uh, yeah. Freaking awesome, dude. Thank you very much. Hi, Demirio. No, Majima. Although I could definitely do a solid snake now with this eye patch. That's on 100%. Uh, do you, oh my god, I don't know if, um, I just did default kind of graphics, uh, I guess. I guess it looks, I, I just turned off motion blur, cause I, blah. Uh, I put everything basically on high, uh, high ultra, I don't know. We'll see how this looks, and, uh, I don't know, I got 3070, it should be okay. Ray tracing off. Path trace, definitely off. Transparency? Oh, that's probably very, uh, intensive. Motion blur on this game helps. Why? I hate motion blur. New game, uh, normal, I guess. I don't know. Probably normal. 60 FPS on this channel, yeah? Back to the beginning. Ooh. We all come to a story with hopes and expectations, looking for an answer. Sometimes it would be better to live with that hope without ever knowing the full story. The sound is beautiful. In the horror story, there are only victims and monsters. And the trick is not to end up as either. But trapped by the genre, we are all ripped to pieces along the way. This is not the story I hoped it would be. This is not the ending I wanted. This story will eat us alive. This story is a monster. And monsters. 
monsters wear many faces. Oh no. Who is that? He's naked. Oh god. Am I the naked guy? Oh my god. It's me. I'm the naked guy. Turn around. Let's see. Oh! Ah, uh, you're being shy, eh? Uh, you're being shy. Okay, okay, you're shy. No big deal. Right, let's go. Okay, this is beautiful. Except for the this guy. I mean, he's beautiful. He's beautiful in his own way. Let's go for a swim. He can't. No, you're not getting blur enabled. You guys, why can't we see his biddies? I paid a full price for this game. I expect to see full dirty. I mean, look at his bum cheeks. Pretty funny. <laughs> full dirty uh, frontal everything. Oh god. No, don't look at me. I'm naked. Stop. No, no, no. Hey, help me. I'm naked and afraid. <laughs> help me. Hmm. What's that? Ah. Oh my god, look at the frickin' graphics! That's beautiful. Do I have an attack or anything? No, all I have is zoom in a little bit. Ah! It's okay, it's just a deer! You can sprint by toggling left stick. <gasps> you guys, do you want to see this guy run? I do. I want to see him running from the front. He can't. That's okay, he's getting bathed. He's getting all wet right now. That means no one will be able to catch him running naked through the forest. All he needs now is a tub of Vaseline. And he is indestructible. Oh no! Hello everyone. Hey, can you guys help me? Oh shit. Uh fuck! Oh no! Oh my god, I saw it! 
I saw his dingle bottom. Oh no! Uh oh. Oh my god. strength to rip open someone's sternum like that with just a knife hmm immersion broken <laughs> that's crazy I like it might take a little longer than I thought. I'm sorry I've been gone so much lately, Logan. Oh my god, Mom, it's not your fault. People get all murdery. What happened? Just work stuff. Right. Well, Dad and I are just watching the latest episode of Night Springs here. Mom, it's so good. It's so Night bright in here now, my god. I'll let you get back to the show. You were supposed to wait and watch with me. I love you both. This is what happens when you go on work trips, Mom. Love you, too. And say hi to Casey. Tell him to stop brooding so much. Logan! I will. Bye, kiddo. Ah, uh, nice AJ. Hell yeah. Logan thinks you should try cheering up. <laughs> Snarky kid. Wonder where she gets that from. Ah, they drink at the same time. The guy's a uh, face model on the left. It can't be a coincidence that another body turns up. Very familiar. Feels like the killer's leaving us a message. Hmm. I'm glad you're on this case with me, Anderson. It's right up your alley. You should take lead. Think of me as the backup. Okay. Any words of advice? Nothing that would cheer anyone up. Here we are. Cauldron Lake. Time to get to work. Time to get to work. A deputy was supposed to be uh, here to show us to the crime scene. This is so heavy! There's the car, so where's the deputy? <laughs> Eaten by a bear? I'll check out that map. Invitation! Oh, oh, okay. We gotta play now, okay. We gotta play. Uh, worth memorizing before we get swallowed up by the trees. Very carefully there. I should take a look at that map. Uh, I should take a look at the map? Okay. Oh my god, that's a very pretty game. Let me see your face! No? Ooh, ooh very Resident Evil there. I have a charm bracelet and a flashlight.
Mmm. What's that? Ah, uh, how do I turn those off? <laughs> ah, let's look at the map. Oh, very nice. Thornton. Hey, over here. This looks freaking great. Oh, she's so cute. Oh my god, let me see your face. Let me see your face. Oh my god, they don't like look at the face in this. Hello there. I'm in charge here. Saga Anderson. I'll be leading this case. Oh, my name is Saga. You know my partner, Alex Casey. Hmm. Sorry about that, ma'am. I'm Deputy Mulligan. I just figured that, you know, that, uh... Damn gonna show up, the damn feds are here. The agent's right here, Thornton. My partner, Thornton, <laughs> down at the crime scene. He's not what you call the sharpest axe. Shift F3 is how you turn the uh, do not disturb. Uh, I don't know, that just opened up a thing. Uh, I could use a briefing. Any witnesses? Uh, yeah, first brief me. What can you tell us about the crime scene? Tell about the heart. I was getting to that. Guy. About the heart? Uh, tell me about the heart. Well, we reckon there are some, uh, organs that are currently outside the victim's person when they should be, well, you know, inside. Oh. Any witnesses? Were there any witnesses? Yeah, a couple out of towners. I wonder what they were doing sneaking around the woods at night. The city Not that we have anything against. City I have an idea what they were doing. <laughs> uh, okay. Don't worry. Sheriff Breaker took them back to town a while ago. Okay. I want Show to me the body. body. How do we get there? Oh, sure. That's real simple. Just through the hole in the fence, down the hill towards the lake, around the old convenience store. You can't miss it. Everything's been closed since the area was fenced off. The store, the campground, all of it. Hey, Mulligan, tell them I'm here, Winky. I'll show them around. They got it, Thornton. <laughs> <laughs> I can hear him, Thornton. I can hear Thornton. Let's go see him. Uh, okay, get to the crime scene. That's my goal. Okay. Uh, yo, dude, Steve, thank you for the 4223. Hell yeah, man. For more giggle water for the near future. Cheers and salute. Get the best love yet. Thanks, man. Thanks, Steve. Hell yeah. Before we get to the crime scene, there's time to review the facts of the case so far. Make sure I'm seeing the. I want to make the uh, subtitles smaller. <laughs> Those are huge. clearly that's better you can access the case board inside the mind place okay the mind place Ooh, mind place mind version of the mind palace technique to sift through clues and work the case Ooh, very sure lock again for each case using each field office as a model in my head mm-hmm the facts are on the board Ah, do I have red string? Every yes, I have red string. Murders. Worth taking another look. The case board is a mental technique that allows Saga to analyze clues and progress. You can use the right stick to move around. And zoomy, zoomy. Okay. You are now free to navigate the case board or leave by pressing B. Uh, no, let's, uh, look at it. Maybe I'll learn something. Mm. Victims. Mm-hmm. Uh, one guy is a dentist, a teacher, store owner, heart removed, murder method. Mm. Bruising on wrists and legs. Deep gash in the chest. All bodies experience bloating. Okay. 
Post-mortem tattooing of the body. The murder targets have no discernible common traits. And chest trauma resembles animal butchery technique. Okay, so, okay, got it. Um, what's my goal? Wow, this is pretty. Um, I see you're already hard at work, Anderson. Oh, it does not pause the game. Let's head down the hill to the crime scene. Okay. Oh, that's pretty. Fucking nature gives me a headache. It's too much sky. We'll run. I like her sweater too. It's really nice. Hey, Casey, you putting me in charge. Why now? Look, Anderson, you're a better detective than I am. You've cracked cases that had the rest of us baffled. I don't want to slow you down. Are you thinking of retiring? You know what happens to cops who say this is their last case. Mm hmm Real funny, Anderson. What happens? Uh. Mirror peak? Can I read that? Not a bad place to get murdered. Hmm. If getting back to nature is your thing. <laughs> uh. Uh. Damn. Should have brought an umbrella. I like the rain. The only thing around here that feels like home. You think the local law had the sense to put up a tarp? Hmm. If they did, next coffee's on me. Yo, Jang Son, hey. I'm gonna go check something out. Be right back. Got it. Deputy Thornton, I take it. That's me, at your service, ready to get this case solved. Now the body's behind the door. Come on, I'll show you. So, FBI, huh? That's yeah, so cool. FBI. Hunting down psycho serial killers and shootouts with the mob. <gasps> we get shootouts with the mob. Cover ups. What? Those are real? You guys hiring? Let's just see this body, shall we? I hope we get to see the body that we uh, started the game with. Now this is the scene of the crime. We found oh. him on the table. Now we didn't touch nothing. You know, oh no! And stuff. Thanks, deputy. No tarp. You owe me a coffee. Okay. Let's start by examining our guest of honor. Does this fit the MO of the previous murders? Body is positioned on the table. Ritualistic. Uh, you unlock your first key image. You can place it on the case board inside the mind place. Okay. Uh, you press up. Key image can be selected. Okay. Place it. Another body turns up just as we arrive in town. Coincidence?
Remember, you can quick access map. Okay. Oh, we can look at the evidence. No, of course it's uh, positioned like this. What's this? The killer left the heart right next to the body. Bruising on the wrist from the cargo straps holding him down. Inside stab wound, chest cut open, heart removed. What about this spot? Put the little clues here. Boink, boink, boink. The clues there. Newly discovered clues can be placed onto the open question. Hmm? Hmm. That one goes there. No? Nah. Nah? Oh, okay. Uh, that has some other kind of question then. Okay. Um, hmm. <laughs> oh, now it lets you... Okay, that doesn't make any sense. Why? Let me put it there. By the wrists. Okay. Previous murders. But this time the heart and the straps were left behind. Oh. More clues to work with. This makes four murders that we know about. Okay, the clues resolve the open question and unlock the deduction. As you advance the investigation, new questions will be unlocked. I'll be your goals. Learn more about the victim, learn more about the killer. Talk to someone. Find evidence. Who is our victim? Who killed him? Need to find more clues. Large amount of blood on the table. The victim died here. Multiple people were here. Multiple killers? When do we start the interrogation? Uh, whenever it lets me uh, investigate uh, that frightened turtle. Someone was drinking beer. They spent time here, waiting. Someone left in a hurry. Knocked the tripod over. Was it for a camera? Maybe. Okay, let's put him on the case board, I guess. So that's the killer's fine evidence. Mm, heavy blood spatter on the table, yeah. That's victim? No. Mm-hmm. That's killers. Uh. Indicating multiple killers. Ah, yeah. Quite the party. That's a terrible party. Hmm. What else would have a clue in it? Maybe the garbage. Gas canisters. I'll be back in a second. Roger. <gasps> An axe. Oh, the there's something. Twig sculpture. Ooh. Blair Witch shit. Wonder what's inside. Uh, confused. I look around for a way to open this thing. Hmm. Uh, wash your hands. Take the chicken out of the fridge. Take a nap. Oh, okay. Well, those are the symbols on it. 
Oh, that's those. Two triangles. Okay. Mm, and there's two more triangles. There's some triangles. Mm-hmm, there's some. Okay, it's uh, sideways mountains with their uh, t tips touching. And um, that's, uh, okay, interesting. Mm-hmm. Hmm, I don't know. That's like the writings of a madman. Uh, what's this? Well, anyways, it did say take, take the chicken out of the fridge, right? So, uh, there's, you can't open the fridge. Hey there, Mr. Deer. You remind me of a dream I had. That's a lot of symbols. And it's the same beer. Okay, what book is that? The Survivalist Handbook. Okay, nothing weird. Nothing weird, but um... Hmm, hold on, fuck. What were the steps again? That's probably the code to the thingy. Wash your hands, fridge, take a nap. Okay, wash hands, fridge, nap. So you'd wash your hands at the sink. But there's no symbol there. So how about the bathroom? Wash your hands. Okay, so it's those triangles. Anderson. Hey. The bow tie. We work over here. Can we? Uh, oh, oh, that's also a bow tie. Fuck, okay, a sideways bow tie, a uh, hourglass. And, uh, the nap part. Hourglass, and then, um... Elevator sideways buttons. Okay, bow tie, mountains, tips touching, and, uh, our sideways, uh... Um, elevator buttons, tip touching, uh, bow tie, bow tie hourglass. Yay! I'm smart. Oh, yeah. I forgot already. No, I had to go through the pictures in my head. <laughs> uh, don't take anything if you aren't one of the trees. I'm a tree. I'll take it. Yoink. Hi, Lane Areas. Hey. Mm-hmm. And that's just some soil. Okay. Mm, uh, and you gotta find some more evidence. Hello, this is Agent Anderson and Agent Casey, FBI. We'd like to come in and ask a few questions pertaining to an investigation. Uh, they don't... Nice talking to you, too. Oh, I'll get in there. Whether they like it or not. No. Oh.
you get lost, Anderson? I didn't get lost. I'm looking for evidence. I'll look around. See you in a bit. Take your time. Okay, I think I found all the evidence. Wait, what's this? They left a lot of garbage. I didn't look Not in here. Type. Someone stole the fire extinguisher. I know who that was. They were playing games, cool. I'd better get a trusty thermos and uh, energizer batteries in this. A thermos brand thermos. Oh, that's locked? You can't lock out the law. Mm. Okay, there wasn't really any evidence in there. That's just like some kind of um, laundromat. Maybe Mushroom Man was living here. Why are you calling him Mushroom Welcome Man? Back, Anderson. Any idea who the victim is? Oh, we gotta ask Go him questions. Sure His name is Nightingale. He was FBI. He came to town about 13 years ago. Oh, he's FBI. I heard about him since. Well, until now. Nightingale. Robert Nightingale. Oh yes. You probably knew him. Brothers in arms. Oh, and sisters. Hmm. Ah, uh, okay, that's a good clue. So we found out about the uh, victim. Wait, was it Nightingale in the first game? That sounds familiar. I don't know what he was, though. So you knew our victim? Well, I didn't recognize him in his current state. But yeah, I ran into him a few times at Quantico. Never worked any cases together. Mm. After his partner got killed in the field, he went off the deep end. Got the boot pretty quick after that. So what happened after you got fired? So what happened to Nightingale after the Bureau let him go? I only know the rumors. Depression led to booze. Booze led to paranoia. He got some wild ideas in his head, chasing mm -hmm. ghosts until he fell off the map. Ghosts. He ended up here. I bet there's more to that story. But no happy ending. Nightingale went missing 13 years ago, 2010. The same as all the other victims. Certainly fits the pattern. Hmm. Makes me wonder what was going on that year. Probably something this town wants to forget. This guy's face is so familiar. I think that. Robert Nightingale, ex FBI, came to Bright Falls 13 years ago. Nightingale is the guy chasing him? In the original... Really? Oh, he looks familiar because he is the face for Max Payne and the writer-director of nearly all their games. Oh my god. Okay. Right. They planned for the murder to happen here. Passing the time with equipment ready. Hmm. They were waiting for him. 
But why Nightingale? He's been missing for 13 years. Why here? Why now? Victim came from... Profiling. Get into the subject's head. See what they saw. Feel what they felt. Use whatever I know about them to guide my intuition to a revelation. Piece it together. You can use profiling inside Saga's mind place to get in the head of suspects. Okay. Using her intuition, Saga can discover new clues by profiling people of interest. Agent Nightingale has been MIA for 13 years. How did he end up here? Up from the lake that's not a lake. It's dark. Oh. He was there too. The lake that's not a lake? You are not allowed in the lake until he says otherwise. Oh! Robert Nightingale came from the lake before his murder. Nightingale was chosen as the victim. Why? Click the switch. It goes click. Lights are off. At somebody's home. Somebody's home. This wasn't some random act of violence. This was a ritual. And Nightingale a component. They didn't see him as a person. More like a container for something. He came from Cauldron Lake. Oh, God. Uh, and uh, why now? After 13 years, where has he been? This mug always cheers me up. Not the worst mom. <laughs> uh, hmm, that's probably true. Okay. Uh, where now? Exit? Yeah. The lake is connected to Nightingale somehow. Casey, let's take a look down by the lake. Lead the way. Sounds good. Let's the lake that's not a lake. Right. Go. Okay. Well, I'll just uh, I'll just wait here. This one of your hunches, Anderson. Did something happen at the lake? I think Nightingale came up from that direction, from the lake. Probably looking for shelter, safety. They were waiting for him. When you're ready, I'd love to hear what you put together so far. Sure. It's not that complicated. Nightingale was out in the woods alone at night, possibly nude. The killers knew he was here, ambushed him, dragged him to the campgrounds, strapped him to the table, cut his heart out. But then they were interrupted by those witnesses, the bookers. Mm. The job is unfinished. That seems pretty complicated to me. What was this guy doing skinny dipping at this time of year? Haven't figured that part out yet. Mm-hmm. Nice tree. Lots of questions. Lots of answers for us to find. Witch's ladle, cauldron lake. I didn't know trees got that big. Gives me the creeps. You need to get out more. It is kind of creepy, though. A li I'd say it's uh, very creepy. I'm I'm thoroughly creeped. Thoroughly. Ooh, we're gonna go in the tree. Yeah, do it. Oh, it's blocked. No, what's this? There's a piece of paper on the ground. Tracks, barefoot, nightingales. They come out from under the boulder. It makes no sense. It's one of the pages a of page his book. With text ah. on the side. Not a printout. Written with a typewriter. Old school. Lines scratched out and edits added with a pen. Mm hmm. Like a manuscript. Page of a story. Hmm. The killer left a message. It's for us. The text is about us. The victim was one of their own. FBI Special Agent Robert Nightingale. And then there was the page they found. 
the first step down into terrifying depths. Reading, Reading the, the words. words. These, These words, words felt like a message. Felt like a message. Someone knew they were here, someone playing a game with them. An invitation. How could they not accept, even if they knew it would end up hurting them? Um... No, I want that off! You were right. This is right up my alley. Nightingale came this way. Either he dropped this page, or the killers left it for us. Uh, profiling, manuscript pages, can be read inside Mind Palace. Okay. Mm, okay. I think uh, he came from the lake, but his tracks make no sense. Oh well, how are we gonna get in there then? We found a page in the woods, a story about these events. What is Nightingale's role in this? I carry his words close to my chest now. Inside. The awful truth. He must dig it out. Something was put inside him. Mm. In his chest. Dig it out, dig it out. I must find out what. We gotta dig into the body. Found all I can here. Time to properly examine the body. See what I can find inside. Mmm. Casey, I think something's been put inside Nightingale's body. Let's tell the deputies to get the body to the town morgue. Okay. Whoever wrote that page made sure it read like a story. Like a scene from a thriller. I hate all of it. The text said we'd find more. I believe it. But what's the purpose? They're twisting events to create their own narrative. To do what? Entertain some fantasy? Projecting their desires? Are we characters or the audience? Witnesses to their design? All the above? It's all about control. Deciding what happens to who. Don't let it drag you in. Too late. I'm already hooked. Mm -hmm. I need the next chapter. What is this creepy old witch's hut? Nothing in here for me except some weird effects. Did I ever see the end of Alan Wake? Uh, no. Uh, no, I just assume he died. Did you know this entire area is inside a caldera? This whole mountain used to be an active volcano. Imagine the force it took to carve this crater out of the earth. Caldera's a pretty rare, so be sure to take it in. So, essentially, we're standing in the gaping maw of hell. You got it. Hey, you made it back. I used to love geology Good. when I was in school. The gaping maw. I a great baking soda volcano for her science fair. Cheating on a science fair? That's almost a crime, Anderson. I'm not gonna say no to quality time with a volcano. I mean, my daughter. <laughs> I hope you didn't get stuck in any of those big puddles. Crazy flooding down there, huh? Just like I said. Deputy, I want the body taken back to town for a proper examination, ASAP. Well, sure, but the coroner won't be back in town for another week after Deerfest. What? Not a problem. I'll do it myself. Oh, and Sheriff Breaker called. To say he's got the bookers at the Oh Dear Diner in town. The Oh Dear oh, Diner? Oh my god. To the gate. It's a shortcut back to the parking lot just up the hill. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Let's get the car. 
Drive to Bright Falls and talk to these witnesses, the bookers. At the diner, right? I, I could use a cup of coffee. Let's try that shortcut the deputy mentioned. Sounds good. Oh dear, diner was in the first Seems game like a nice too. Town so far. Ooh. Aside, pretty woods. Cute lodge we got set up in. We should go for a hike if we get a chance. Now you're just being mean, Anderson. Ah, oh, we're going for a hike right now. Exactly up to the task, but hopefully the sheriff will be more helpful. Not a surprise about the deputies. Doubt they see much stuff this gruesome. What's that? That looks dangerous. I want to go in it. Why don't you boost me up there? I want to go up there. Oh, uh, you can't do that yet, I guess. Probably not going to let you. Can't fit the clues all together yet. Heart removed. Tripod. Tracks leading to a dead end. A tripod for a camera? To record a, a snuff film? Maybe. Mm. And why take out his heart just to throw it away? To stuff in something for us to find. The stuffing is all that matters. Mm. Especially Thanksgiving, yes. Which way do we go? Oh god, I haven't been looking at the map. Well, it looks like we're going the right way. Uh, he knows the way to go. Uh, hey Dan Lee, hey honeybee. Hi guys. Here we are. Ah, the cars! Let's head to town and meet the sheriff at the diner. You ride in the trunk. I can't get that manuscript page out of my head. I've never seen killers reach out so directly before. Damn impressive work so far. With your technique, these hunches were moving fast. I wasn't sure about taking a case so far from home, but I'm thrilled to be here for this mystery. Jesus! Whoa! Lunar! Scared the you shit out of me. Lodge to get anything from the field office? Thank you for the six dollars sixty-six anyway. cents. I walk to the diner. Get Friday. The town. Thanks, man. The, the fuck are those just things? Up the waterfront. Shouldn't keep the sheriff and our witnesses waiting. I smell coffee. I uh, made a new alert. Seeing what I put it, what I put it under. Mm, Twenty. That's why. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, all right, so... Ooh, this is nice. This is a cute little town. What's that guy doing? Oh, he's taking a selfie. Most streamers usually have a list of what alerts do. Meh. They can suck my alerts. Hey. Hi, who's this lady? Just how much coffee have you had today, Charlie? <laughs> don't know, don't care. <laughs> how much have you had? Not enough. That's all. Dear Fest. Oh, dear. You. When do I get a gun? Let me guess. The FBI. 
Welcome to Bright Falls. It's nice to have you here. I got you both some coffee. Oh, it's Yay. Washington's finest. Nice to meet you, Sheriff. I'm set for coffee. You know, I wouldn't say no to another. Might be drugs. Don't Saga take it. Anderson. This is Agent Alex Casey. Tim Breaker. And let me just say, I'm happy you two are here. Frankly, we could use the help. Your deputies said you had a couple of witnesses here. They made them sound like suspects. Mulligan and Thornton are still on about that? No, no, the bookers don't strike me as the murdering type, but you can decide for yourselves. They're just inside having coffee and pie to calm their nerves. I'll see what they have to say. Casey, you compare mm. notes with the sheriff. Take your time. Coffee and pie? Through the case Cake. Files, mm. over, sheriff. Yeah, many okay, uh, you are eating pie and soup. You have soup. You have pie and coffee. Probably them. Mm. I can't believe that happened. Must be these people. Excuse me. I'm Agent Saga Anderson. Are you the bookers? That's us. I'm Tammy and he's Ed. Hello, officer. Just Saga is fine, Ed. So are we being charged with anything? Because if not, we'd love to get back to our hotel and decompress after what we saw. Take a bath, scream into pillows, that kind of thing. We're not charging you. I just have a few questions. Nothing to stress about, okay? Mm, can you tell me what you saw? So what did you see in the woods? <gasps> oh my god, what if yes. I can play the Lime and the Coconut Duke song? Lake, and he was acting crazy, shouting weird shit at us. He must have been on something. Unless skinny dipping at dawn is a thing around here. Then we heard shooting. We ran into these psychos in deer masks. They were tearing into the naked guy with knives, like some kind of satanic cult. And then we bolted and called the cops. What were you doing at Colgin Lake last night? I'm a writer. True crime. We're here from New York, doing some research on a famous novelist, Alan Wake, who went missing here. I was down at the lake, getting some details. Ooh. Perfectly legal. What makes you say it was a cult? <laughs> the masks and knives aren't enough. They were shouting, cult of the tree. Oh. The cult of the tree. <laughs> cult of the tree. Oh. And then we found a... What? The whole thing was terrifying. Oh, what did you find? The bookers. Oh, I like that picture. That's cool. How else are you going to make it in the stream world? Um. Oh, handy. You should try quantum break. I should, yes. The cult of the tree. What are the bookers telling me? I found their necklace. The symbol is two triangles. The cult wants their spruce tree back, Tammy. Finder's keeper is Ed. My publisher will want this on the cover. Tammy found something. A necklace belonging to one of the cultists. Ooh, okay. Oh, why didn't you give it to me then? Bad. This was built to hide what's there. They say the rider fell in the lake. Private party. No trespassing. My book has questions. Past the bolt cutters. They mm. broke into the sake of Tammy's book. Nothing to do with a the murder. They were telling the truth. Uh, 
Case board. Put it somewhere. Or wait, no, it doesn't go on this one, does it? Killer profile. Talk to someone. Them! I talked to them! Yeah, there you go. We're dealing with an organized group of killers. Not a lone serial killer. Case closed! The cold of the tree <laughs> is behind these murders. This case just became much more complicated. Uh, end of the On game. Roll credits. But it's my first cold case. Exciting. Ooh. Ooh, new folder. Whoa. I need to know more about the cold of the tree if I'm going to shut them down. Okay, what kind of cult? Uh, it was a deer cult. No, uh, that's their psychology. Okay. Uh, they had a lot of tools. And they like triangles. Nah. Cult symbols. Ooh, okay. Uh, they worship uh, Pythagoras. Fucking Pythagoras. Points of interest. Okay, put this shit on the wall here. These stashes could contain clues about the cult. Better keep an eye out for more. Hmm. Stash found near a home mobile home. Okay. Yeah, put it there. Mm, cult stashes, that one. Put that there. Good job. So you found something there, right? Hey, Penavalos. These cultists may have dropped. Okay. Wow. I didn't yeah, want to draw it on. Put that together? It's evidence. You need to hand it over. The eye patch is right here. I told you not to keep that thing to me. Mm-hmm. Uh, I remember that one, yeah. Be helpful. Do me an a AC Odyssey. Stick around town for now in case we have any more questions. <gasps> like we'd even dream of missing dear Oh, God. Saga! Saga Anderson. As I live and breathe. I thought we'd never see you back here after that awful, awful thing happened to your baby girl. What? How are you? Um, I'm sorry. Who are you? I don't know what you're talking about. It's me, silly. Rose. You know me. I don't think I do. And what horrible thing happened to my baby girl? She drowned. Your daughter? That's so weird, you don't remember. How do you know I have a daughter? Oh, I know what this is. You're blocking out your traumatic memories. Happens on TV all the time. No. You're mistaking me for someone else. <laughs> if you say so. That's really creepy. Super sus. I think we need to hear uh, Lime in the Coconut song to uh, make us feel better. Hi. The eye patch completely blends in. I didn't even know you had one. Yeah, you can't see it on my head, can you? What the hell? Where is it? Here. Um. Hey, Dark Swords. Yeah, totally sus. Okay, where's that jukebox? Better fuck it. No, it's out of order! The poor old thing can only take so much of the same song being played over and over and over. I'm as big of a fan of Coconut as the next person, but come on. You guys, that probably means they didn't get the freaking rights for the song. That's so stupid!
can you be so calm? Quirks is a part of the job. Can't dwell on it too much. Oh, it's playing! It's a miracle! You guys listen to this while I'm going to the washroom, okay? VRV! glad they included that with the game thanks developers good for them Was the ghost singing in the game? Maybe. <laughs> hey, Will. Okay. Doing good. How are you doing? Thank you. Okay, that was really freaking weird. Uh, wasn't the... The diner waitress really weird in the first Alan Wake too. So Rose, help me out. How do you think we know each other? We all know each other around here. It's been a while, but I never forget a face or a coffee order. Guess I just have one of those faces. 
seen anything out of the ordinary in town lately? Suspicious people in deer masks? No one's suspicious. But soon enough, there will be lots of happy people wearing deer masks for deer fest. Oh, no. Practically everyone will be wearing one. Good to oh, know. dear. She has a cutout of Alan. In the first game, yeah? Does she still have it? Hello. All set. My guys have Nightingale at the morgue, if you're ready to go take a look. Oh, I'm ready. Hell yeah, I'm ready to look well, inside a body. I got a lead. Looks like we're dealing with a cult. The cult of the tree. A murder cult. Oh, so Alan is no more in Alan Wake 2? Why is your character an FBI cult agent? Tree, Sheriff? Well, I don't want to spoil it for you. If you're in the woods at night, the cult will get you. That sort of thing. We're not going to find out you're the Grand Wizard or something, are we? The Grand Wizard. Back in the day. Wizard was always my favorite class. That's not what he meant, but uh, good, good, good answer. Mm -hmm. Wizard, <laughs> not that kind of wizard. To keep this city clean, if not I. Who's this guy? Hey. Who else to protect its citizens from the morning, dangers sir. of unsanitary like conditions? You have some guests. Ah, uh, morning, Ted. Yeah, real important guests. Deerfest always draws a crowd, right? <laughs> Too true. More the merrier. Have a good one, Sheriff. No, you have a good one, Sheriff. This is a nice little town. Hey, what do you know about that waitress from the diner? <laughs> Rose? Yeah, she's a bit of a space case. You always have been. She's extremely creepy. Why? What'd she do now? She kept saying that my daughter drowned. She even knew my name. It was all very weird. Rose has a talent for saying the weirdest thing possible. But it's best not to take it personally. What the fuck is wrong with her? Hey boss, corpse is downstairs ready to go. Yep, in the morgue, all prepped. I'd like to take a closer look as soon as possible. Lead the way, Sheriff. First, I will look at this map. Okay, there. Oh, this is the Bright Falls Sheriff Station. Anything you need, just uh, let us know. We appreciate the support, Sheriff. Hey! I heard that cat too, yeah. So we share a morgue with the funeral home next door. It's a shoestring budget. I guess you guys don't have that problem, though. Our only coroner rotates between a few other towns, and he's away this week. But you can handle this, right? I'm qualified to perform examinations. Yes. Awfully dark in here. Ew, what's that puddle? Well, that's a stain, not a puddle. Uh, yeah, ridiculous. I know, I know. I've been doing it. They always cheer me up. I can't say I feel the same. He's joking. Hold on, what's inside this? <gasps> Batteries! Oh my god, what brand are they? Hmm. I can't get through this. Why is it so dark in here? Oh my god. Ah, I have Bill Steven, yeah. Just one stream again. Okay. Let's take a look at our patient. I'll start with the external inspection before performing the internal examination. What was the cause of death? Again with the Damn angle. The Why am I not allowed to examine the dungus. Defensive wounds. They put up a fight. Hmm. What are these? This looks like text. A tattoo? Nightingale didn't strike me as a tattoo guy. Uh huh. They did leave something inside his chest. What is it? The body shows signs of being submerged in water post mortem. It doesn't add up. There's writing on here. Can't make it out. Writing? How'd they manage that? Is there a camera mode? <gasps> Whoa, that's how 
I could do it. Okay, good idea. Good idea. Time to see what Nightingale's body can tell us. Anything to learn from the body? Yes, many things. That to learn. This. Think, Saga. Text is smudged. Looks inverted. Heart can't have been marked before removal. Ugh. <laughs> There's definitely something in his chest. Did the killers leave it there? Well, rip it out. Rip it out. Nah. Nah, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, it's called symbols up here. piece of paper. Uh-oh. It better not be another manuscript. No gloves either. Ew. Same type of page we found at Cauldron Lake. Oh, shit. Nightingale hunted Saga. Didn't see her. The Taken could not see into bright light. Mm -hmm. Light hurt them. Made them vulnerable. Nightingale had no heart, but here he was. Killing. Someone's created a fucked up fantasy about us. Hey, hold on. We found these kinds of pages. I didn't think they were relevant to this case. I have them right here. What the fuck? Sheriff? What the hell? Oh no! Casey! Oh my god. No. Is it real or is it a dream? Because that's fucking crazy. Didn't see her. Could not see into bright light. Try staying in the light to avoid being detected by enemies. I'm in the light. Safe havens will restore some of your health. If you leave or attack from a safe haven while in combat, it'll become temporarily unavailable. Go.
He knocked my gun out of the room. I need to find it. How do I get out? He's gonna see me. He just fucking walks back and forth in there. Need to get my gun. I heard him say coffee thermos. Ooh, it's finally popping off. He didn't have a heart, but he still got up. The page predicted all of it. It helped me fight him. Oh, oh, oh. He, he just oh my god. So that actually happened? Okay. We need to figure that out if we're going to do anything about it. Somehow. Saga was back at Cauldron Lake. Saga had to pursue Nightingale into the overlap. Finding a way in would be difficult. A ritual. Saga would learn how. Stop the monster. Hmm. You okay? I will stop the monster. This is unfortunate. The heart is gone too. Hey, I Hawaii. Hey, hey Mega X. Hello, coolest reviews. Hey, Mario. Uh, point your flashlight at him. I uh, was trying to aim the flashlight like this, but it wasn't letting me. There is no rational explanation to what we just saw. <laughs> I'd love to blame this on mass hallucination caused by inhaling volcanic gas, but we both know that's bullshit. Mm. This was supernatural. Well, I'm glad you were the one to say it. Yeah. Now we can figure out a way forward. Right before things got crazy, Sheriff Breaker just vanished. Maybe the sheriff knew more than he was letting on. Hmm. He seemed anxious, like he dreaded what was coming. One more mystery. The victim of a ritualistic murder turns into a monster. Is there a connection? Looks to me like the cult of the tree is performing rituals to create monsters. Hmm, maybe. We need to start with learning this cult's goal, their purpose. Let's do some more clues on the wall. Cult goal is to create uh, monsters. Okay. Um. This would be symbols, I think. No. It's part of the ritual. Writing is part of the ritual. Okay. Nightingale was the only victim to become monster. That we know of. Think saga. Is it its own clue? No. Who's involved? Obviously, that guy's involved. Uh, cult goal. Uh, this right here. Nightingale attacked us. A dead man turned into a monster. Light as a way to fight him. Pages predicting the future? There's no rational explanation. This is the case we must solve. Hey, where did he go? Let's see. 
Mm, oh, the uh, letters. Oh. Radio. Hey, Lapana man. Uh, wait, he can't be saved. He is that brooding hero with altruistic mentality. Do I do profiling? No, I don't think so. What are my goals? Figure out where he went. Well, he went to the lake, the obviously. Nightingale back at Cauldron Lake. Calls him a Taken. We need to head over there, stop him, before anyone else gets hurt. Okay. He's a Taken? Okay. You know what we're gonna need? More batteries! Mmm. -hmm. And are we not concerned about this guy? Like, uh, are you still alive? Are you okay? Should we call another police or something? Also, where's the battery level? We, we heard gunshots, y'all okay? Did you get spooked by the bodies? Sheriff Breaker disappeared. Nightingale turned into some sort of a monster and there are offices down. You two handle things here. We need to get back to Cauldron Lake immediately. Fuck me. That's terrible. We'll do what we can, man. They're not concerned that their fellow officer is just dead right there? Okay, uh, let's see. Batteries, perhaps, in here? That's crazy, right, Thorn? Nightingale's heart was missing. How could he do anything? He's dead. Am I playing this in 1440? Uh, yeah. That's all. Does it look good? Talk. Monsters aren't real, and what do you mean the, the sheriff disappeared? Like, huh? He's gone? Magic? What's that? I need something to cut this. Why don't I just ask them to open this locker for me? Uh, actually, there's just a bunch of stupid papers in there. Why would I want that? Let's go look for something to cut that bolt with. Oh dear, I am a tourist, and it appears that I'm lost in the woods. If only had a tour guide also. Bear. Oh no, a bear. Ooh, hello, what are you typing on? He doesn't know his password. Mm, oh, maybe the battery's in here. Oh, there is, yoink. What are you doing in here? <laughs> you think of everything and we'll take you anywhere. Hiking through the scenic Elderwood National Park. Fishing in the crystal clear waters of Bright Falls Dam. Bird watching at Majestic Mirror Peak. The tour of a lifetime is just one phone call away. Um to get a 9% discount on this limited edition Oh Dear Diner coffee thermos. Oh, I want that! 
I want to call them because they have bolt cutters and I need those. <laughs> hmm. My client has been held here long enough. Are you going to let me speak to them or not? Uh, just a moment, ma'am. Someone will be right with you. Hmm, I need to find, um, uh, a knife, bolt cutters, uh, ooh, a toilet, ew, the sink, oh my god, that sink's never been clean, also, uh, you can't see a reflection in the mirror. <laughs> I know one of you is stealing the toilet paper. I've been counting them and there's an entire roll missing. Every day from stock. <laughs> uh, okay, fuck. Uh, what kind of nut counts toilet paper rolls? Sounds like you've got too much time on your hands. <laughs> well, I want to steal one now. I can't force it open. Even deadly premonition. Yeah. How many times do we have the mirror has worked in there. Huh? Thermos. Thermos. Whatever. I want out. Something bad's going down. I can feel it. Let me out. Talk to me. None of these people want to talk to me. Do you think I like throwing you in jail every other day? No, I don't. Do you have any idea how much paperwork? Okay, come on, partner, let's go. Nightingale and his cult are dangerous. We need to be prepared in case things escalate more than they already have. Can you call it in, Casey? A smart choice, Anderson. Yeah, a Agent Casey here. Yeah. We need backup. The Bright Falls case. Whoever you can spare. ASAP. Think we'll actually find Nightingale at the lake? The pages haven't been wrong yet. We can't assume the person writing these pages isn't playing us. I agree. But it's our best lead. Hmm. I don't know if it's everything's explorable in this or not. Like, should I be going around looking at shit? I'm gonna take a quick look around. Meet you back at the car. Pig diaries? Marisetta won't roll over on the issues. Did I start over? No, 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 we just, uh, had some problems, um, in the basement of the police station. The town, Anderson? Just getting my bearings. Ready to go? Waiting on you. Mm, I was hoping to, like, find something, like a... A gun or something cool, I don't know. Mm, I guess not. Okay, back to the... Scary-ass forest. I know why Nightingale was here 13 years ago. He was chasing a writer. Ooh. Tammy mentioned him. She's writing a book on his disappearance. You know the detective character from his books, Alex Casey. Yeah, I've heard the jokes at the office. Cold case Casey. Murder case Casey. <laughs> Sorry. Ha <laughs> ha. 
It's the same name, similar job. It's the first thing anyone thinks of. It annoyed me, but that was it. Then, ten years ago, I started getting strange letters in the mail. Fragments of prose describing murders. No, I didn't have Ray Chasing You've on. I've heard the stories about what happened in New York. Some of it, at least. Bodies started to pile up. It was a murder cult. Turns out the fragments sent to me were from the crime books of Alan Wake. The cult was copycatting the murders from the books. In their heads, they were performing a ritual to bring Wake back. Oh. Their imagined prophet. Mm. After that case, I started looking into Wake's disappearance on the side. And you thought this case might be connected to him? His name does keep popping up. I just wanted you to have all the facts. Next time, give them to me before we find ourselves in the middle of a horror story. <laughs> oh, the heart. Okay. Return to the heart. Oh, no. The page says Nightingale's in something called an overlap. Need to figure out exactly what that means. I'm happy I'm not in charge of this mess. Thanks. Let's start looking for Nightingale where he was killed. I don't want to wake, wake up. Hey, what's this? Whose motorcycle is this? Great. This area is supposed to be close to the public. Ooh, now I have a gun. Yeah. Uh, those are some uh, good uh, tips, Lunar. Agreed. Yo, Zeller, hey. I want to know what you think of this game. Uh, it's only just like the beginning, so. So far, it's freaking amazing, like beautiful. The writer of these pages knows what will happen. And scary. Because they're behind this, or because they can see what's coming. Impossible things are happening here. A world operating on different rules. I need to understand this strange logic. To see the clues. To solve the case. I've been thinking more about the cult of the tree. What sort of cult refers to themselves as a cult? In my experience, they don't. Mm-hmm. We're not seeing the full picture yet. What are those guys doing at that thing? Hey. Hey, hello there. Oh, it's How the are you um doing? those restricted area signs. Hello. Damn thing. Saga Anderson. The guys from the TV show. Are you two supposed to be here? I'm Ilmo Koskela. Fantastic to meet you. And yes, Stephen here hired me to show him through the woods. He's in town on important government business. Fixing this impressive piece of hardware. I work for the FBC, ma'am. I'm authorized to be here. And I bet you two are here about that murder. Nasty stuff. How's it going? You know about the murder. I do hear about the murder, Elmo. Do you know anything that could help us? People tend to tell me things. The Koskala brothers are kind of a household name around here. Speaking of... Uh, if you're looking for some fun, stop by Watery. Just down the road from Bright Falls, there's our Coffee World Amusement Park. There's Sauna, Sauna de Vista. <laughs> and we offer a variety of variety tours, hunting, fishing, hiking, whatever strikes your fancy. You name it, we probably got it. Mm, what's the machine what do? What is this thing? It's just a monitoring station, ma'am. The Federal Bureau of Control checks volcanic activity and air toxicity levels. You want to put no the eye patch on? It's mostly for research purposes. That's one gorgeous weather saga. <laughs> Looks Nordic. I bet a family member made it. You want to put the eye patch on? Oh, you look beautiful. You look beautiful. He's purring. My mother made this sweater for me. How do you know? I knew it. My mom used to knit those sweaters for me and my brother. Watery, my hometown, was founded by Finnish immigrants. 
So between your name and the sweater, I figured your family might be from Finland too. Suomi, Finland. Hulla, Karjalan piirakka. Klaus, my mom's family is from Sweden originally. I don't know much about them beyond that. The sweater is just something to remember her by. Stephen, we're investigating a murder that occurred nearby. What can you tell me about your bureau? Nothing the... classified, I'm afraid. The people from but Control? I don't know anything about a murder. Operations here are run by a different department. I'm just here to make some repairs. The wiring on this thing frays every couple months. Yep, that's the raccoons. They grow real big here with teeth like you wouldn't believe. Can not run through a garbage can. Hmm. That's I would go in there. Hmm. Hey, Mystic. Um, Zeller says, have you and Dusty ever considered getting a dog? Yeah, we would love one. We just can't have one in this uh, apartment building. Maintenance note. Maruka, sit down. You be good. Sit down. Um, hmm. <laughs> Someone tampered. Hello, you're so cute. We brew our own beer too. Ahma beer. Oh, now we're talking. Mm, oh, that's his motorcycle that we saw. Yeah, okay. Let's get to the murder side, Casey. Are they not allowed because of potential barking? I don't know. It's just like that, and they cause more damage than cats, I guess. I don't know. Me. Also, the place but is too one small. Thing feels really off. Breaker's disappearance. I don't get the feeling Nightingale was responsible. Hmm. He was about to give you more of those pages. Something didn't want us to have them? Mm hmm. What was protecting him from Nightingale? Spontaneous combustion? I don't know. I. Not the kind of disappearance we normally solve. Our crime scene's drowning. I never minded rain. Feels like home. No sign of a nightingale. But the page did place him at Cauldron Lake in an overlap. So how do we follow him there? Maybe something around here will tell us. Yeah, what the hell is an overlap? Let's see. What's this? Fresh foots prince? Ooh. Nightingale. I'll see where these footprints lead. Can you come through the crime scene one more time, KC? Just in case. Let's split up. Oh, no! Yeah, let's split up. There's a murderous monster on the loose. Okay. Actually, let's go to my mind palace for a sec. I gotta put a, um... Thingy here. Oh, uh, okay, I'm here. And what's that? Investigation. The overlap is where Majima likes to sit. Hmm. I don't see the word overlap. Ruka, what are you doing? Rule, uh, line of horror never split up. Yeah, no kidding. Oh, I didn't get the sheriff's station map. Oops. Well, let's follow his trail. Nothing bad can happen. You follow him. Okay. He definitely, definitely ran downhill, and uh, that's a good guess based on his abilities and stature. The 
tracks lead into the water. Mm. Where'd you go from here? I can feel something. A presence. Nightingale isn't far. I know Nightingale is somewhere around Cauldron Lake. The tree was a threshold. Mm? This place and the dark place. <laughs> You're in over your head. Next stop. Caldera Street Station. The threshold. Like a doorway. Leading to Nightingale. It's somehow connected to a tree. Ooh, that tree that we Which saw. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Anti Kate Bush running down that hill. I cannot for the life of me uh, figure out the reference. Hey, flip side, hey. Okay. <laughs> Explore the witch's ladle area. Okay. Mm, wait, I am in witch's ladle. Oh, what's this? Witch finders station, okay. Which is ladle? Okay. Good. Which is ladle? Blah, blah, blah. Oh my god, the tree. Oh, the threshold. No, I don't want to go. Seems like it's reacting to the light. Ruka, get off of there. Hey, get off of there. Hey. You're not supposed to stand there. You can sit there if you want, right here. Zephyr the footprint. These Ooh. aren't the same tracks that were here before. They're headed into the tree, not out of it. Oh. Toggle flashlight boost to increase damage to darkness and burn through dark substance. Oh. Okay. Light burn the dark stuff away. It was covering another page. The fuse was in place. Saga stepped into the witch's hut. Inside, a bright light. Mm. There were objects that stood out to Saga, as if the light had manifested them. The witch's hut. Okay. I trust the pages to lead me to the overlap. Okay. I've been to the witch's hut. Oh, I gotta look at the manuscript. <laughs> blah 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 blah. Okay. Case board. I got a new thingy. Where did Nightingale go? He went here. Light is the key to stay safe. But for something more to be revealed, as well. is Witch's Ladle the doorway into the overlap? If so, that's where I'll find Nightingale. I need to find the Witch's Hut. Mm, I think I know where it is. Uh, oh crap, wait. 
Was that blocks before? Oh wait, no. What the fuck? This is the witch's hut. Anderson, thought I saw something in the woods. Probably just a deer, but I'm gonna check it out. Okay. I found another page. Following up on a lead. Keep checking in. Roger. The fuse box is missing a fuse. I need to find one to turn on the lights. Okay, maybe the fuse is over here. Don't break, Bridge. Don't break. This fuse is busted. Aw. You can just make a fuse, can't you? Just a, you know, a metal nail between the two things. Yeah. Something weird is going on down there at the big house by the lake. Wait, am I supposed to technically read them, read them? Is that a kid's lunchbox? An Alex Casey movie lunchbox. I know things get a little crazy around here, but if you're ever feeling scared, the same name as a fake detective. He hates those cheesy crime books, but he really hates the movies. Alan is watching over us. Mm, manuscript fragments uh, can be used to upgrade weapons. More bullets, another headshot. Hold the fire button to activate auto fire. Mm. Let's go for headshots. Uh, let's do that one. No, I don't have 12. What the? Uh, what the fuck? That's expensive. It says I have a freaking weapon upgrade. No, not gonna work. <laughs> oh well. This one looks good. Ew. I think we should really stop littering though. the break room it's a save manual save why not and quick save oh, everything and free thermos Ooh, what are those whoa that chair is wild
Brooke, you keep coming and going. What is your plan? Another page. Making progress. The image of the witch in the sign. Saga addressed the witch. The smudged line on the heart. The second part recited from memory. I brought you the heart, witch. Show me the terror. Saga pushed the heart through the hole in the sign. Ooh, I know where the hole in the sign is. Okay. The page from the witch's hut seems to be describing some kind of ritual. <laughs> Ruka sits. Hey, Stephanie! Thank you for the five, Stephanie! Yay! Woohoo! Hell yeah! Thank you! Kindly. <laughs> Nightingale's heart disappeared from the morgue. Where is it now? Hmm? I got a profile. Let's find out where he'd put the heart. Nightingale's heart to get to the overlap. Where is it? Just leaned close. He was there, but he was risen. Nightingale was there. The opposite of sunspots. Who said that? That's not it. I don't have what I need to find Nightingale's heart. Oh. There must be more. I will keep looking then. The FBI teaches you to move suspicious chairs. Nightingale's heart. Where is it? For a while, they played cards in the general store. The witch had stolen his heart. Get out of my house. Nightingale's heart is at the general store, in a fridge. Hmm. Good. I need to check the general store for the heart. Okay. Casey, I'm headed to the general store. I think I know how to get into the overlap. Roger that. I followed some ATV tracks in the woods and got a bit turned around. Did you get lost? I've only been lost once in my life, Anderson. The years I spent with my ex-wife. I'll find my way back, don't you worry about it. Dahmer much? Is it related? Oh, general store. Okay, I just gotta go straight and then, uh, you know. Something's going down at the store. I'm gonna go to the lights. For safety and, uh... Is that? <laughs> Thank you. The pausing works. Who? Uh, Nico. Thanks for the ten. <clears throat> ten. Hope you're having a good one, Megan. Eighties earlier this week, and five to ten inches of snow tomorrow here. Oh my God, that's bullshit. Thank you, Nico. I already read that. Ah! 
fast. Oh. <laughs> uh, it's just a deer. Silly deer. What are you doing in there? Ah! Wait, does he have a special spot? Oh god, he does. A cultist. A monster. Like Nightingale. How do you use the trauma pad? Oh, heal, right trigger. Ah, oh, there, okay. Check with Lady Fortuna at the counter. Lady Fortuna? Okay, I want that. You don't remember if the heart specifically were in the fridge? Oh, for Dahmer? I don't know anything about it. Mm, before I grab that heart, um... Mm, that safe has been opened. Uh, what's Lady Fortuna? I mean, this? Oh, don't forget update code. Lady Fortuna. Oh, that's the Lady Fortune or this. She could also be. Um. Uh, so they got numbers from her. Mm-hmm. Uh, to guess the lottery numbers. And then this is the one they bought. Three digits. Um, fuck. I don't know. Is it, am I supposed to? Oh, am I supposed to be able to discern the? Is there a pattern to it? Maybe it's a pattern. Don't don't tell me. Um, seventeen twenty three. Oh, I know what it is. I got it. Okay, so first it goes seven oh five, then it goes seven thirteen, then seven set seven seventeen, then seven twenty three. Now, 739 or 745. 739, 745. Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah, that was it. Woohoo, new gun. You could quick slot weapons from the inventory. You quick slot healing items. Oh, I should do that.
Mm, I don't think I... Do I need the batteries? I don't know. Like, in a slot, maybe. Mm-hmm, there's something in there. Can I have it? I almost had it. Oh god, there. There you go. Okay. Ah! The text on the heart is clearer now. Legible. The wave crashed on the far side of the mirror. I feel like I recognize this. The fridge. The heart. I knew it would be here. Like I saw it in a dream. Mm. And now I need to give the heart to the witch. Makes total sense. There's the heart. <laughs> Found the heart in the fridge. Just like the page said I would. To get into the overlap, I need to find Nightingale's heart. Read the line imprinted on it, plus the line on the page to the witch's ladle sign. Uh huh. And push the heart through the hole in the sign. Easy peasy. Sounds literary, but what does it mean? Mm, my grade 10 English class, it prepared me for this. Ah, oh, okay. Point of interest. Okay, that's point of interest. Ooh, Funny little lunchbox. The lunchbox out here can't be a coincidence. Another message? Ooh, mmm, big messages. The victim was one of the. I don't want to listen to scary fucking. Agent Rob. His voice is too scary. Um, the witch's hole is right there. No, no, I gotta go put the. Uh, where the fuck? Where's the witch's sign again? Casey, there are cultists in the area. They're taken, like Nightingale. Watch yourself out there. Yeah, thanks for the heads up. I'm still finding my way back. You have the worst sense of direction. <laughs> Any city in America I can get through drunk and blindfolded. It's these damn trees. Okay, okay. I'm en route to Witch's Ladle. I need to perform a ritual to open the overlap. This case just keeps getting weirder. But it is exciting. Put the green herb in the witch's ladle and light it on fire. <laughs> that sounds like a good ritual. To be honest, I could go for that. Uh, I gotta go the frickin' ladle again. Okay, so I go left here. Weird, creepy old phone booth.
Mm, it is really easy to get lost, honestly. The sign wasn't at the witch's hut, though. Which is ladle, I guess that's it here. It says which sign right there. Uh, perfect. I'm standing in the light. Oh no! The ritual. Bloop. The wave crashed on the far side of the mirror. I brought you the heart witch. Show me the terror. Some scary ass shit. I, see. I think I'm in the overlap. Are you still on your way? Casey. Casey, do you read me? Fuck. Okay, Saga. Going in solo. Uh, going in solo. Hold on. Uh. Logan? Mom, help. Logan! Mm? Where are you? What the fuck was that? Logan's back in Virginia. You're imagining things. Oh, uh, what the hell?
Okay, it was nothing. Wait, uh, hold on. Uh, where did I go? That's where I came from, right? Please help me. Oh. What was that? Oh, the tree is multiple times. Wait. Okay. Did I get turned around? Oh, it put me through a no, loop. This, right. this place is looping. A nightmare. Need to find Nightingale. Mm hmm. The current pulled back with the darkness inside into the lake. Nightingale was there. Okay, it's just birds, right? No, there he is! Or not. Conveniently placed. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, Stephanie. Thanks for the two, Stephanie. Appreciate that. Wait, there's always treasure behind a waterfall. Except right now. What's the clicker? The remote control? Ha, 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 ha. 
Oh, what do you got there? He has a big stick! No! I'll shoot you right in the bussy. I got a shotgun though. Kaboom! I was supposed to go in that red stuff. Okay, I gotta fight him again. Not that way. Oh God.
I'll be ammo in there. Come on, go! In danger. The dark presence. Take a breath. He's he's changed the story. The dark presence. We must stop it before. Easy now. First things first. What's your name? My name is Alan Wake. Oh! I'm a writer. I, I've been. Wake? Where did you come from? You've been missing for thirteen years. What? Jumanji! In the dark, oh wait, in the... After each chapter is a song. Andrews, where did you go? Has it really oh, been 13 years really since the last flooding, game? And then the flooding just disappeared. The crazy forest. Is this who I think it is? Casey. Say hello to Alan Wake. Mr. Wake, this is Special Agent Alex Casey. <laughs> He'll escort you to our car. Casey, I'll meet you there, right after I take a look around. If the flooding's receded, there might be evidence we missed earlier. Okay. See you there. 
Wow. Alex, Casey, how am I still? Is this the dark place? No, it can't be. I got out. Yeah, the PI from your books has the same name as me. Great. Moving on. It's a bit of a hike to the car, Wake. Just get your bearings, then we'll head out. I just, I, I need another minute. Cauldron Lake. I thought I'd never see this place again. He needs Take another 13 years. You know these woods aren't the safest. Yeah. Uh, it's getting dark. May 14, 2010. Whoa. No, it's not safe without a light. I uh, yeah, ultimate light. sharps. Yes, it is. PC. You can relax. Uh, you guys, I have to go to the washroom. Pages. Um, if you see pages of writing anywhere, you must take them and keep them safe. Our lives could depend on it. They have vital information. We know about the pages, Wake. We'll keep an eye out. Okay. Okay, just give me a moment. It's okay. Take your time. Uh, I'll be right back, guys. This is a very inappropriate time to play that song, game. That's weird. Now let me get this straight. Put the lime in the coconut to drink bowl up. Put the lime in the coconut to drink bowl up. Put the lime in the coconut. Hey, Casey. What's the forest's favorite shape? Please, Anderson. Just one case without the A triangle. I don't get it. Yes, you do. But that case was completely different. The trees, Anderson. He hid the bodies in the forest. timing <laughs> okay thanks for waiting guys thank you mm. 
Oh, thank you for the 500 likes today, Songwa. With the welcome back and the, ooh, nice gift. I like that one. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> so they're still standing here? That's kind of awkward. I'm getting kind of hot. I'm just wondering if I just, well, not hot, but just like. I don't know if I'll be even more uncomfortable with this off. Eh, maybe. No one's gonna know who I am. They started telling jokes. Uh, were they any good? Mm, told a joke while you were gone. Uh, what is, uh, what was the joke? Tell it to me. I'm so hungry. I brought some beer. Oops. What did I do? Nothing. It's like the fight scenes in Yakuza where they rip their shirts off. Oh, yeah. That's me right now. Yeah. Okay. Uh, oh, dear. What was I doing? Oh, my God. He looks like shit. What is a forest's favorite angle? Oh, uh, hmm. Try, I, uh, obtuse, isosceles, is, equilateral, uh, I don't know, a triangle. Oh my god, that is lame. Fuck, okay. Oh my god, that's bad. I got, uh, tattoos, yeah, later. Mm, mm hmm, <laughs> thank you. Hmm? Mmm. Red Lion, thank you for the four ninety nine. Wouldn't you listen to that song after thirteen years? Yes, of course. Thanks, Red Lion. I'm just gonna make sure there's no cat hair in this drink, because Ruka did walk over top of it. Mm, yes, there is, okay. Scarred that. Uh, tattoos sue you. Oh, well, thanks. Okay, this is, uh, enough awkward silence for them. I should be playing the coconut song. It looks like the lake just spat him out. Yeah, definitely. This is beautiful. Wow. Should look around. With the flooding gone, could be further clues out there. Ooh, maybe. The flooding disappeared very suddenly. I wonder if there's any connection to the overlap. To Nightingale. If Saga Lady met Ruka, what kind of cat would she think he is? Oh, hmm. A cool cat? Um, a jazz cat. But I don't know. An overlap cat. Mm -mm. No, I don't know even what that means. <laughs> That's uh, over my head. It did say to uh, look around since the water has receded or whatever, but... Mm. Maybe there's treasure. 
a joke based on lap cats. Overlap cat. Oh, smart. No, no. What happened? Oh, who took big bites out of this guy? Yuck. I see a box here. Ooh, Unlock the old the double triangle. Oh, what's the code? Is that the code of the tree symbol on it? Oh, that's Notes it. And ammo. Looks like they're tools of the trade. Mm hmm. Uh, yeah, I thought I was gonna be uh, a long one. Um, mm, you just checked. It says getting photo mode in an update. Strange they didn't start with it. Uh, but yeah, Bionic is right. They they knew people would upload the penis shots to Twitter. You can't have that on release week. I know. Hey, thank you for the five polish HD. Poly I don't know how to say it. Thanks, Paul. Appreciate it. Thank you. Hi, Megan. Hi, Paul. The cult doesn't see their victims as people. I should I should answer that into my Thank you. Notes. Yo, Jay Rambles. Hey, thank you for the two. How scary is this game? At some parts, extremely scary. And then some parts, uh, normal. Not scary. Got both. Nightingale goes missing for 13 years, shows up murdered, and then turns into a monster. After I stop Nightingale, a rider who's also been missing for 13 years turns up. What's the connection? What kind of case is this? A fucked up case. I already saw that one. <clears throat> it said optional investigate the previously flooded area, and I did, but maybe there's more? Is this previously flooded? Oh yeah, there's something. Hmm. <laughs> Can't say anything, probably on thin Canadian ice already. <laughs> Hi, Alec Marshall. Hello. Okay, I got a little manuscript page that was hiding there.
lock chest in this area. Yeah, I just grabbed it. I don't see anything else though, so uh Let's go. Uh uh oh, how do I leave? Oh shit. Oh, here's a trail. This has to be it. Please be it. Oh, God. No, I don't want to read those. Too scary. Ooh, <laughs> quick turn. Why are you telling that to me? Oh, shit. No problem, Bionic. What the fuck is that? Oh god, whoa. Oh god. Hi, cult of the tree. You're in the game. Oh, look at that arrow. Wow, that's convenient. That arrow says to go that way? No! Okay. Ooh! Stream side stash key. Did I... I must have missed a stream side stash. Yeah, I remember those arrows in the first game. Yeah, those were convenient.
Ooh, today's catch. Whoa, Lunar! Lunar, what? Thank you, Lunar. Whoa, dude. Thank you for the 50. Never was one for making friends. Yeah, same. Lunar, thank you. Oh, man, dude. Thank you for supporting the stream, Lunar. Appreciate that very much. Thank you. Kindly. Very nice of you. Uh, hello, Forks. Hi. Lunar, super fucking nice of you. Thanks, man. Thank you. Uh, okay, today's a uh, catch. Do, do, do. Out of towner, walking around the woods before sunrise. Had binoculars or a telescope, didn't notice me, good under the attention. Today's catch, a boot. Mm, that's not the lakeside stash. Well, wait a minute. What happened to the fisherman? Dog gone, more like fisherman gone. Oh, this is nice. About what? What? Uh, Oh no, this is not weird. Uh A little clothes pindle. Perfect weird souvenir for Logan. Mm. Oh, a boot. <laughs> not a boot. Oh, no. There's something written here. A poem? Or a riddle? Reminds me of the nursery rhymes I read to Logan when she was little. Ooh, one bird for light, two for darkness, three birds for a fight, four for a struggle, five for injury, six for misery, seven for the ending, whatever it may be. Feels different. Uh, one bird for around. light. Okay, I did that. A charm. Cute. It'll go great on the bracelet Logan made for me. It's putting on uh, oh, charms. That was strange. Gotta keep an eye out for more of these rhymes. And just murder eight charms on my bracelet. <laughs> uh, what's this? Propane tank. Oh. Who the fuck is that? Don't look at me. Oh, his special spot's on his back. That's unfortunate. Was a lot of wasted uh, ammo. Ooh, I did that to his arm. Uh, 
Abandoned campsite with oddly good looking leftovers. Yeah, that's kind of weird. Actually, that's just a bun. But yeah, those fruit look suspiciously fresh. He's mad because he took his lucky charm. <laughs> How are you supposed to hit that? Probably go around him. Probably. So, did this teleport me into some fucking freaky ass world here? Or did that just make that guy appear? Crow doll. Uh, okay, let's do another one. Oh, wait. Oh, I can't. Oh. Oh, it was just that? Dang, okay. And that's too bad. I thought it was gonna be like, put it on this one for this effect, and this effect for this one, yeah. Oh, you were adding to the poem, and a partridge and a pear tree. I think that's the wrong, um, wrong season. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't know how you get him to turn around, Stranger. Well, I have no idea. Maybe you rent... Uh, I don't know. No clue. So you empty a pistol and then pull out a shotgun from your pants. Yeah, just like real life. Where do you guys keep your shotguns? Uh, oh, is it this? Is that this game? Oh, come on. Ooh, I'm almost at stream side. Okay, I'm almost there. Yeah, fucking BS. Is what that is, yeah. Although, uh, let me look at the map again. I'm there. Okay, it looked like there was something off the thingy here. Maybe there was. Hold on. I should just... Follow my nose, like, uh, Tony the Tiger says. Or was that... Toucan Sam. No, that was the Trix Rabbit. Maybe it's in the private cabin. Ooh, private cabin. Oh, wait. That was a little path up here. I will go to the private cabin as well. Hello, Ruka. Ruka, what you do? What are you doing, Ruga? The murder sites! Mm-hmm. No. Oh, too scary. FBI, they have the training? Oh, yeah. They do. Watch this. <laughs> FBI, open up! See? Uh... 
Uh, the sun, as she sleeps, knows not the woes of men who toss and turn and worry and fret and wish they had her blissful slumber. Mm, okay. Nothing is suspicious in that letter. Oh, a duck. That's not right. Whoa! You got AOL on this thing? Oh. If it's like uh, anybody else I know, the password is written on a fucking thingy here. Uh, the password says two, two, five, four, seven. No, that's not enough. Or that was the correct thing. Oh, okay. Easy, buddy. Don't touch that thing in the dark. What the fuck? Hmm, the light scares away the monsters. Let's turn the flashlight off to stroke a dead uh, deer. Is this... No, that's not the cabin from the first one. Ooh, the FBC! Uh, oh, the FBC! Fucking don't let me be. Hmm. Hmm. Oh. We will create nursery rhyme tags with a specific function and then use the depicted dolls and symbols as needed via a careful testing process with the purpose of the story told in the fiction manifesting itself in real life. Okay. Of course the FBC is doing this. <laughs> Thank you. Fucking weirdos. Hey, Burnaby, thank you for the five. Oh, I forgot. Moose are huge. Agreed. Agreed. Thank you, Burnaby. Moose are huge. And yeah, should have charged a buck. Mm, okay, I did one stream side. There's two at the Witchfinder station. That's where I am. And then there's one at the rental cabins. Okay. I guess I gotta catch them all. Ooh, little wolf. Okay, there's one of these. Hero doll. Creepy. I gotta find the special place to put them in. A VHS. Uh, 
Uh, but it didn't say uh, the test sites. Oh, the test sites. Okay. Well, I don't see where to put the little dolls. Yet. I didn't close that door. Did I? Oh, it's a bathroom! Yay! Whoa. Whoa, there's no water in the toilet. Okay. Irrelevant. Oh good, there's one of the things. Another one of those rhymes. I know. Yesterday was so impressive. They actually reflected you in the mirror. This doesn't even fuck it they didn't even try. How hard is that? Come on. I don't know. It probably is very hard. Who knows? If the military was staring goats and CIA had spy cats just for a try. Oh my god, yeah. Uh, um, and also, um... Mm, remote viewing? Ooh, remote viewing. They taught, tried to teach people. <laughs> um, shotgun in the pants is just another day in the office. Absolutely. Uh, what are your thoughts on the game so far, if you don't mind me asking? Oh, I actually quite like it. I'm impressed with the depth. And it's interesting. The hero so brave and strong left home to right a wrong. From the woods came the wolf, so greedy and hungry that he ate what he found. In the house without a host, the hero returned to find she lost the thing she loved most. Hmm... Okay, so I do have a hero and I have a wolf. Mm. Ah. The wolf ate the thing out of the tree, and the hero... No. No? No. No water in toilet isn't a positive sign. I guess it means they turn the water off, yeah. But, I mean, that's kind of good. Like, when you're dealing with uh, areas that can... Freeze and stuff, yeah. Uh, it's more that the reflection is usually considered coating fat that is trimmed off to keep the game size manageable. Oh, I always judge games on that. Uh, okay, let me just see again. Uh, what the fuck? Um, left home to right or wrong. Uh, well. The, the wolf definitely comes from the forest, but mm, the hero came home in the boat. I have a weird feeling something's changed. Something has changed. Shit's about to get weird. What, what are those? Uh-oh. A wolf? Okay, then. Um, something tells me they didn't look up how a wolf walks. Unless it's bipedal. With a... Hip issue. 
<laughs> oh shit. Please don't be bipedal wolf. Oh, it took a big nasty shit right there. Oh Another charm for my bracelet. Oh, when you picked up a charm out of a pile of shit? Ooh, she saves you from death, but shatters in the pro process. Okay, whatever. Oh, okay, that's gross. Nothing else has changed. Except someone took a shit! Oh, nope, never happens. Ah, can't forget the dolls. Huh? Might oh. Need them again. Let's go get those dolls. Uh, a, a, a giant friendly dachshund. Yeah, I, okay. That's a good theory. Creepy dolls. Mysterious rhymes. No weirder than anything else going on, I guess. True. <laughs> Holy crap, that's so many. Oh my god. A dark mm -hmm. substance. Um. Can I just place them automatically? Baldur's Gate 3, everyone has played it. And what about Jagged Alliance 3? I, I don't even know what that is. Nope. The FBC is definitely playing with things they don't fully understand. And that always goes well. Mind your face, it's uh, quite good. Quite good. <clears throat> Doesn't make sense. I mean, that had rhyme in the word on the picture. <laughs> there we go, strange dolls. Okay, we solved it. Okay, so now uh, I have to go oh, to private cabin. Mm, and nobody appeared to fight me this time. Mm. We've reached the car, Anderson. How's it going down there? I think I'm done here. I'll meet you at the parking lot. 
I am done here, but I never went to the private cabin. Uh, what the fuck is that? Ew, a bunch of uh, painted rocks. A lunchbox again. Ooh, wonderful! I need that. Who's leaving these out here? Some fucking weird. Uh, obviously you're gonna su uh, succeed, or else you wouldn't be the hero. Duh. Ooh, nine manuscript fragments. Is that enough to upgrade my shit? Oh wait, gunsmith, shotgun. Oh. Oh, I only have 10? You fucking kidding me. How much does it cost to do the shotgun? Throw me a bone, Scott. Ugh. Show me the map. Okay. What the fuck? Come on, load. Oh, stream side. That should head to the private cabin. Hmm. <laughs> um Did that change it? No, it did not. That was very rude of me to shoot that. There could have been birds inside. Hmm, there we go. Less a lake, uh, more a pond. Yeah, I think if blood started streaming out, ooh, that would be really gross and sad. I keep getting turned around, it's so disorienting. Oh, I already passed the private cabin. Oh my god. Wait. I gotta turn around and then take the first left. Hey. Who the fuck is over there? Oh, those bitches down there. Okay. Mmm, actually, wait, I don't need to go there. Mmm, here's the private cabin. This is what I wanted. Ooh, a generator! Those guys are down there. Hey! Why are you looking at me? Hmm. Wait, I don't think I should be fighting them from up here. <laughs> Unless he wants to turn around, I'll shoot a special spot. Hmm. Yeah. Ooh. They just want to yell. That's all they do. 
FBI, open up! Oh, yay! If you beam their face long enough, do they turn? I think you have to blast them. Are you sure? I saw yellow paint on tree too, yes. Uh, okay. Oh, I have to crack my back. Oh, whoa. And quick save, both, yes. Oops, nope, I pressed the button by accident. Who what else you got in here? Mm. No one has ever played Jagged Alliance games. Lunar, I've never even, I have no idea what they're about. What is it? Hey, Nico, thanks for gifting a membership to Justin. Thanks, Nico. I gotta put this jacket over here. Ruka, watch out, baby cat. Nice, Nico. Nico times one. I think, okay. Thank you kindly. Hmm, okay. Really no other fun little thing in here for me? Come on, just a frickin'. I can't even have that X. Oh, another ritual! Wait. A mother crow sits in her nest, guarding her babies, doing her best to protect her home from the beast coming to feast, but only a hero brave of heart can keep the two apart. Uh, okay, hero goes in the heart, crow goes in the tree. Uh, although the crow could also be with the babies and the wolf could be coming from the forest. Thanks, Saga. No. Ruka, are you trying to come up here? Come here. No. Doesn't make sense. Hmm. The hero can uh, keep the two apart, so it goes between them, yeah. That's Ooh, it. there you go, it's had them backwards, yeah! Ruka! Don't do that, bad boy. Ruka, for fuck's sakes, don't do that. They're still down there, okay. Uh, what did that do? Usually something happens or you get something. Last one had a trail, should have left a charm. Mm, what do you mean? Mm, 
Yeah, maybe Mr. Tasty. I do have the special pillow that um, this chair came with, but I didn't. I don't have it. I put it over there. Oh, I hear you. Can't forget the dolls. Might need them again. Yeah, I can't forget the fucking dolls, but what did it do? Usually it gives you something. Oh, you're the hero between the wolf and the crow. Oh, man, that's smart. I will go see. Um, but if I take the dolls, will it like reset the thingy? Maybe not. What the hell is this? Oh no, the crow's house! Oh! Another charm. Good thing Logan made me this bracelet. Uh, oh, there you are! Fucker! Get me, bitch! Oh, shit. Oh, last shot. <laughs> that was the only shot I had. Left. Increases hand flares duration. Well, I don't have hand flares yet, so... Cool. Wait, I found a charm and a necklace? But no bullets! Shit. And no batteries. The crow did the friendship rattle. One of your charms is consumable. Yeah, yeah, it said uh, that when I, if I die, it'll uh, break. Make a throw rug, ew, out of a wolf. Okay, we'll do a quick save here. Um, but socks, I don't have batteries or bullets, so. And I can't bust into that box. Where am I? Am I not at the stream side? I am at stream side! And I have the freaking stream side uh, container key. So why doesn't it work? Uh, oh, it actually says something on it. Cauldron Lake. Am I not in Cauldron Lake? 
at the stream side stash. Wait, container screwdriver? Wait, I never got that. How do I get the screwdriver? Uh, shit. Find the orange juice and the vodka. That's the last thing she needs right now. There's a guy there. Uh, this has to be it. Ah, uh, what? Fuck, it even says screwdriver on it. The stash key is probably for the yellow paint box. Maybe need to get past the dude. Yeah, I have two different places to go right now. Um, there is a dude there, so if I go past him. The thing is, down here there was um, two enemies. So wait, what's that? Point of interest. What's so interesting? This? Very interesting. Oh, I do have a flare. Um, I don't know if you can kill them with the flare. Probably you can just keep them the fuck away from you. Mmm, get away from me, weirdo! He's not the guy I need. I'll go back to the riverbed where I saw the... Whoa! That thing runs out after a while? Oh my god. I remember it doing that in the, in the first game. Okay, take me to the stupid fucking river. Drop me in the water. <laughs> the 
Thank you. Why? What? What? Dan Lee with the hundo? Dan! Whoa, dude! Thank you for supporting the stream! Thank you, Dan! Whoa, man! That's freaking really nice! Thank you very much, Dan. Hell yeah. Oh, wow. Uh, Dan, I appreciate it so, so much. Thank you very kindly. I'm going to crack open a, another cold one right now. Damn, Dan. Thank you. Well. <laughs> oh, I don't know. Let's, uh, let's pour it. Cheers, Dan. Thank you. Well. Mmm. <laughs> That's really nice. Ah, uh, that's a dead end. Yeah. Ruka, you are being naughty. Ruka, all he's doing is fucking jumping on me, walking back and forth. He's not being a mindful panther. Oh, look what, uh, that looks like a teenager tried to draw a, um, mm? That thing teenagers always try to draw and fail. Uh, what the fuck does that mean? Seven minus two. Five? Five what? Oh, eight plus three. Oh, is that the code to something? Okay, five plus three, eight. Oh, wait a second. Six plus two is eight. The cult is leaving supplies around for themselves. Rock, rock, tree, are you bright enough? Uh, of course I am, rock, rock, tree. Rock was five. Uh, wait, so rock, uh, five, uh, why does that one just say plus three? Maybe it's just, uh, five, five, eight. Oh, so that's six, three plus three, ah, uh, five, six, Eight. Nope, six, five, eight. Yay, ah, oh, we're so smart. Oh my God, what do we get? No ammo, thanks a lot. Oh, wait, this is, uh, is, oh, that's nothing, fuck. Uh, such a walking overlap cat. Yeah, he's naughty. Naughty. He's standing down there staring at me. He doesn't even get anything up here anymore. The fuck does he want? Oh, 
Oh no, a dead end? What the hell? Oh, I'm never gonna find Riverside Stash. This is bullshit. And I need uh, the uh, screwdriver. That's a dead end. Oh, wait, I can go up here. Ooh, what's this? Vodka mixed with orange juice never works unless you order in a, it in a bar. Yeah, stuff does taste different when you make it at home. It tastes like shit when you make it at home. But suddenly, when the bartender makes it, puts in a little cup with a little skinny little half straw and maybe like a little cherry in it, it tastes way better. Hey, Alicia. That was the one way to jump down, which you couldn't get up earlier. Oh. Okay, that's gotta be Riverside Stash there. Oh, yeah. Gimme that stash. Oh, no, there's no key. Okay. Ten bullets! Yeah! More Easter eggs. Okay. Ruka, you're naughty. You're not doing anything up here. You're being naughty. More Easter eggs. I wonder if I'm supposed to shoot them. Another lunchbox. Ooh, lunchbox, okay. Yes! Time to upgrade my stuff. Frickin' finally. I got 19, so uh, I want, uh, ooh, headshots well. Uh, I apparently am not very good at uh, landing headshots. So, unfortunately, there isn't, like, a damage up, and that's what I was wanting. That's the only thing I want. Uh, damage up is the only thing that would make sense for me. Otherwise, increase magazine size, you know, I guess that makes sense. Yeah, I'll do that one. Saga had lost count of how many shots she'd fired, but she was sure it must have been more than she had in her magazine. And yet, she'd not run out of ammo, as if the magazine had grown to fit more bullets. Ooh! She fired again. Ooh, the headshot one could help you get at the weak spot. Oh, fuck. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Shit. God, oh, fuck. Yeah. Oh, if you bang bang, then you can get behind them and shoot the back. Yeah, some of those, uh, one of those zombie bastards had, um, yeah, it had a backpack. Ooh, hello, you have a backpack! Whoa, where's your sensitive spot? What I got away, you fuck! Turn around, bitch! Whoa! Whoa, man! Oh my god. Yeah, get the fuck away here! Shit, fuck. I gotta use this. 
Yeah! Oh, the fucking thing! Uh... I'm stuck. Man, I got him. Oh, he had a lot of ammo on him. And my poor charm broke. Well, whatever. That's good. Good for the charm. It saved me some time. Rip-ups. <laughs> 80 proof did that oh my god hopefully someone just took you home okay it's time to go how do I leave All the way over there, the parking lot? Ugh. It's strange. I just can't get the screwdriver. I have no idea how. Um. Oh wait, I got a new clue or something? Rhyme. Oh. Um, here? Hmm. Ooh, looks like I missed one. There's a general store. Oh, uh, hmm. I guess I thoroughly looted it already. Uh, what does that red mean? Does that mean blocked? Probably. Okay. Mm oh, wait. So I was facing this way. And I want to go this way? Oh, God. Okay, is it left or right? Come on, you can load any time map. Oh, I gotta go, um... Left. Oh, of course there's guys there. Two of them for fuck's sakes. Oh yeah. Oh, 
Oh, this fucker has the backpack. Oh, I dodged that, you motherfucker. Oh, he dropped batteries! Ah, yes, and what else? This carving looks fresh. Mmm, why would they do that? Mmm, oh, the buzzy noise. What does it mean? Oh, what kind of alert is it? Oh god, there'll be a tornado alert. That's the last thing I need. Lunchboxes. Mmm. Uh, have a heroic day. Ugh. The fuck are they doing in here? Ugh. Clear signs of tampering. Mmm. Oh, we read that uh, already, I think. Uh, but why the fuck? It's like showing something on the warning. Activity detected. A W E. Event in progress. Cauldron Lake. What's an A W E? Ah. What exactly does the FBC do? <sighs> After New York, when I started looking for our friend here, their name came up. I pushed them for any files they had on him, but got stonewalled. They have a reputation of showing up for weird shit. They have a presence here, and now we find our writer. How about that? Mm, maybe the biscuits are done. Oh, that would be... Oh. That would be fucking great right now. Oh my god, a biscuit? Mmm. I can't wait to get the fuck out of this stupid forest. What's that way? A secret dead end. Ooh, what could it be? The rarest wildlife. Hmm. That's not good. They're for sure dead. Hmm. Oh God, where am I? Oh, I'm in the right place. Yeah, the parking lot. Oh, I fucking love parking lots. Yeah. Mm, sorry, that took me uh, eight hours, partner. You ready to go? <laughs> yeah, fuck yeah. Let's get the hell out of here.
<laughs> oh my god. That was loud. Mr. That Wade, back crack. We're taking you back to our field office in Bright Falls. You can freshen up there, and then we'll talk properly. Hey, Mom. Before you say anything, I'm totally fine. Don't freak out. Dad shouldn't have even texted you. Logan? No one texted me. What's going on? I'm totally fine. I slipped. That's all. God, it's not the end of the world. Oh, we um, okay. had that warning. Dad, it's Mom. Don't worry, hun. Logan slipped in the shower and bumped her head. She has a slight concussion, but I'm keeping an eye on her. Lucky I heard her fall. She could have drowned. Jesus, David. Why didn't you call? I tried. It didn't go through. She That's died. fucking creepy. But what about you? You sound stressed. No, it's a... Uh, just a weird case, that's all. Well, if you need a hint, my years of board game victories tell me Colonel Mustard did it. <laughs> I'll, I'll keep an eye out for him. <laughs> Love you, Dave. Love you too, honey. Fucking Colonel Mustard. Ugh. Just tell her I love her. Bye for now. Logan? I don't know the girl's name. Cute. <laughs> Is there anyone you'd like us to reach out to, Mr. Wake? You've been gone a long time. No. No. They'd be in danger. Hello? Come for me. Okay, let's talk about something else. Two old Robert friends, Knighty. Lunar yeah. said. What? You were both here in 2010. Cheers, Lunar. Don't Two old God. friends. Yeah. Hell yeah, man. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lunar. Oh, fuck me. Tell us about the pages. You had what looks like a title page with you. Return. Is this the name of the story on these pages? The writer's name has been scratched out pretty violently, but your name can still be made out underneath. <laughs> scratched out. Yeah. Scratch. Did you write these pages? Why? What does he mean, I'm scratch? To remember it. Lunar, thank you so it's, much. It's a crazy jumble, like a, like a nightmare. I, it doesn't... It doesn't make sense. I remember. I remember. What does he remember? Oh, 
late night. Waking up in places with no memory of how I'd gotten there. It was out of control. I didn't need another mugshot in the fucking tabloids. What was that? So? Oh, was yeah, that look at those. Hard boiled, <laughs> not just eggs. Okay, if I get a single egg in this game, I will die. Oh, it's wake time. Wakey, wakey. Wait a minute, who is that? I felt a strange pull toward the TV. Don't let the TV pull you in, Mr. Wake. We should play the piano. Or exit. Oh, fuck. I can't go anywhere. Okay, I'm going into the TV. FBI, open up! Ooh, this is creepy. <laughs> Live action shit. <laughs> Good to see you, Alan. Uh, this must be an exciting time for you. Tell me, does it ever get old? So does what get old? Publishing a new book. Are you okay there, my friend? You look like you've been cooped up in the writer's room for a few too many years. This is exactly how I feel. <laughs> you know, I've waited so long to get my hands on the sequel to Departure. You left us on quite the cliffhanger. We've all been dying to know what it's not a lake, it's an ocean really means. You and me both. Well, our game <laughs> is over. Your new book, Initiation, <laughs> hits the mm. show tomorrow. It but does! That's exactly what every reader will be asking. This book is mind-bending. Red so Lion, beautiful. thank you. How would you describe it? A, an auto-fictional thought experiment? A, a, a horror story? A, Postmodern detective story. Wait. Wait. Scratch was Alan's evil right. replacement. I, I haven't written anything. I have no idea. I don't remember. He's so humble. Okay, you got me. Good prank. Very funny. But yeah, I sad to say, I, I I've not written this. I, I'd remember if I'd written a book, right? Or Wait. This guy was in Homeland. Was written by your evil double. <gasps> oh, evil double. Oh my God. So really, that is him. Well played, man. That is spot on. Playing the role here. Pretending the world of the book overlaps our own. That's very meta indeed. You see, Initiation tells the story of a fictional writer. Homeland was ooh, who is trapped in a night. Ten out of ten agreed. Desperately trying to find the manuscript of a novel he has forgotten he has written. The book is set in New York, but it might not be New York at all. He is tormented by his dark doppelganger and guided by visions of a fictional detective he has written. That's right. Alex Casey is in this book as well. Uh, mm. I guess we'll just keep doing this the whole show. The joke's on me. But isn't that what you signed Thank up you, for? Thank you, Dan. Auto fiction? No, but seriously. I found the, uh, the structure of the reality you build in the book fascinating. It reminded me of The Matrix. I mean, the writer is physically in his writer's room, trapped there. And he projects himself out to this dark dream of New York through the story he is writing. Uh, like astral projection. Did I get that right? Yeah, that's exactly right. Go on. I should be taking notes here. Uh, this is great stuff. Notes to that other Alan Wake in that room writing this as we speak? Are we all in your story, Alan? No, I, I, I wish you every success with your new book, Alan. I hope it's as successful as your best-selling Alex Casey series. Initiation hits the shelves tomorrow. After this, I'm sure we'll all be eagerly awaiting the culmination of this hero's journey trilogy of yours. A book called Return, perhaps. 
Yeah. Thank you for one of the strangest interviews of my entire career, Alan. All this talk of meta narratives. Can't expect me to disappear once this scene ends. Sol solipsism uh, does work, absolutely. <laughs> uh, yeah. Ah, uh, that's very nice of you, Sailor. Hello. Hello. No. Oh God, I don't have a flashlight. Something's not right here. I needed to get home to Alice. Homeland was good until they wrote up Brody. Then it lost me. Oh, he was the best. Uh, but you know what? He uh, Brody comes back in. Um, Millions or billions, whatever the show is called, just pretend it's like a continuation of that. Uh, he's so good. I really like that actor. He's really good in, um, mm, it's some spy thing with, uh, this fucking Englishman spy thing. So good. Uh, who the fuck is that guy? I don't know. He's like what in the everything. Hell was that interview? Some kind of joke? Initiation? I never wrote a book called Initiation. This felt like a bad dream. Could make a good horror story. <laughs> Don't say horror story. Uh, Band of Brothers? Oh. I'll have to... Oh, actually, yeah, I know what that is, yes. Oddly enough, though, I can't remember him in it. How the fuck do we get out of here? Oh god. Oh, down here. Okay. Press the button. Oh god. Oh, the doors are locked! Old gods of Asgard. That name sounded familiar. Mm-hmm. Where is that from? <laughs> Ah, uh, that's funny. Okay, um... Whoa! Damien Lewis, that's his name. I always forget his name. I was a mess. I'd never heard of this talk show or Mr. Door before. None of it felt right. Was I losing my mind? Dr. Casper Darling. Uh, I feel like we met him in Alan Wake 1. Wasn't he that creepy-ass doctor? The neighbor of the beast. It was in the previous, there was yeah. Something here. A broken transmission I couldn't quite make out. Oh, I don't want to go on the that? TV again. It tickles. Oh, impossible to say. All that static. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, God. Wait, I can't go on the TV. Oh, what the fuck? Didn't know that street table. You just watched that yesterday. Oh my god. No. I had to get out. Oh god, go. Ah, he's coming! No! This is the ritual to meet you all. I felt like a drowning man gasping for Not air. my typewriter, no. This place felt familiar. A ghost of a memory surfaced about riding here for countless days. I had been writing. 
initiation. You must write to escape. Oh. A plot board for mapping out a story. On the index cards, the nightmare that just happened to me. A summary of the story so far. But other notes as well. Warnings. I had written them. I couldn't remember what it all meant. The name Scratch filled me with dread. I could trust these words. I had to act on them. You must write to escape. My goal is to get back to writing. No. I wish to look at the plot board. Can't do anything there. All right, I'll fucking write something. <laughs> Just write poo poo. P that's what I would write. Nico, thanks Nico for the 10. Hey yeah, thanks man. I didn't remember much. But I knew my thoughts and ideas could manifest as reality in this dark Appreciate place. that Nico, thank you. I used my writing to project myself out of this room. Like a deep sea diver to go deeper and explore the depths of the Hi Hunter. For a way out. This room was my boat. Writing was my lifeline. I would start again at the talk shop. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Alan, you're scaring me! Thank you, thank you, thank you! Oh, you're too kind. Welcome back. Uh, we have a great show for you here tonight. We'll treat all you Alex Casey fans out there. Alex Casey himself is here tonight. Right. Oh no! The actor who has given his face to the famous detective in the film series. And of course we have Alan Wake here. Best-selling writer, the books, the films are based on. Let's do this! <laughs> Let me out of here. Oh, no. Welcome back to the show. So, Alan, as the uh, creator of the character, how do you feel about this? Sorry, what? I, I know it can be an awkward question with the man sitting right next to you. Hey, Farm Factor. How do you feel about him in the role of Casey? Does he look the part to you? He looks exactly like I always imagined Casey to be. It's uncanny. Thank you. That means so much to me. Mm. I'm a huge fan of your books. So, uh, what's the problem, Alan? Because on more than one occasion, you voiced your reservations about the adaptations. Uh, it's not that. They're their own thing. They've gone with choices that are different from mine. I. I I feel protective about my stories and these adaptations. I, I, I don't know. I, I guess I just wish I could have been more involved in making them. Well, in that case, you won't have seen this either. We have a clip from the new film, Murder Case Case. Should we roll it or do you want to say something first, Sam? Nah, just roll it. <laughs> This city was an old scar that refused to heal. The rain made it fester. It needed the sun, but there was only the night. I was tired. Insomnia covered me like a plastic film. I was watching the world through a rain-slick window, my own reflection haunting the view. I was trying to track down a missing writer. My only clue was a table lamp shaped like an angel. The only thing that shed light on this sordid mystery. Oh, 
That's great. Murder case, Casey. Great job, Sam. <coughs> very exciting and very meta. I'm looking forward to seeing more. Wait, stop. What was that about a writer? About a lamp? Oh, he would like to know. He would like to know and, uh, well, uh... So would I. <laughs> oh, you guys. I gotta put my jacket back on. Uh. Guys, not book, knock a pumpkin off. Ah. Uh. It's a great jacket. Oh, I love this jacket. Uh, thank you, Ataxia, for this jacket. Freaking amazing. Uh, he bought it off my Amazon wish list uh, a couple of weeks ago or a month ago. And I'm so glad I get to wear it. Fucking love this jacket. Um, oh, and the eye patch. Oh, God. I gotta do it properly. Nice work on the costumes, all been outstanding. Thank you, pretty sweet. Thank you! Oh, thank you. I put a lot of effort into this one. A lot of effort. This eye patch, you can see through it. I made this this morning. Secret recipe. Glad you guys like my costumes. That's right, that right there is uh, who I am, is Majima. Now you guys, we are gonna play this tomorrow too. It's gonna be great. Um, and, uh, oh, you're gonna see a very cute costume tomorrow. Which one's it gonna be? Am I gonna use the eye patch out in public? Oh, absolutely. Mmm. I have three costumes left. And... I don't know which one I want to do tomorrow, which one I want to use on Halloween. Oh man, I have no idea. I got three really good ones left. Uh, fuck. You're gonna like them all, I know it. They are the most expensive and elaborate ones the next few days. So please, uh, make sure you tune in tomorrow in the next few days, uh, for my best costumes yet. Uh, now I want to thank uh, you guys for watching today and thank you for uh, uh, Supporting the stream. Oh, you know what I should do is um, My headphone cord here I told Lunar I would uh, shoot his pumpkin, but I was thinking maybe It's not very sharp. <laughs> oh, it's dead. I killed.
nailed it. Oops. Just a flesh wound. Uh, you have wooden legs on a- and a hook. Should I get earrings? Yes. Shoot it? Okay. I'll shoot it, and if I- when I shoot it, I will, uh, take a video. For you. Just gotta, uh, get the, uh, proper firearm. <laughs> Uh, oh yeah, I have a sword. Hell yeah, it's 2 V's sword. Did you see the YouTube videos about a girl on the islands who chops wood with a sword axe? No. That sounds great, though. Ah, uh, thank you for being on the mug, Steve. Appreciate that. Thank you for supporting the stream. Inspect a deck! Whoa, you gifted a membership to Ghostface. Inspecta deck times one. Thank you for the gifted membership. Yeah. Oh, the song would donate 500 elixir on Trovo with the cone gift. Majama everywhere can even be under a cone. Yes. Thank you. Hi, Niraj. Hello. Or leave my pumpkin alone. You're gonna get it! You're gonna get it! He's gonna get it. Uh, yes. Uh, Steve, thank you for winning the mug today. Thank you for, uh, supporting my stream. Also, thank you... Um... Nico... Red Lion... Lunar... Dan Lee... Thank you, Burnaby, J. Rambles, Paul, Red Lion, Stephanie, mm, Steve, Christopher, uh, Fishy, Galaxy. Mm -hmm 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 -hmm. I got everyone! Thank you for supporting my stream today. I appreciate you guys so much. More than you. I even know, okay? Uh, come back tomorrow for more Alan Wake 2 with a new cosplay that you've never seen before. A real good one, okay? Uh, a, a rather elaborate one. Good night, friends. <laughs>